To me, my hotheads, and welcome to the Man Cave 101 podcast, where we talk all things nerdy. I am your hostess with the most, is your number one BS guy, Abel, alongside of me tonight, man in the chair, Aaron. What up, dude? I'm just trying to figure out who the real gene is. <laughs> we still don't know to this day. <laughs> Spread love, it's the Brooklyn way, Big Chase. That rhymed, by the way. No diddy. Oh, oh, hey, 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 God, God. What, what was that? What was that lyric that Meek Mill said? Like, uh, about something with Diddy? He, there oh, was something like, in yeah, there. I, I hope the hood forgive me for what I did. For what I did with Diddy. No diddy. Live from the man cave, Leo. What's up? I ain't trusting nobody no more, <laughs> <laughs> bro. Yeah, who's sorry. who's next? Anybody oh. can get it, bro. It's crazy out there right now. Oh, all I know is don't offer to take me shopping. I ain't going with you. Yo, don't I ain't going with you. I ain't going to no party. <laughs> oh, I ain't bro. my hair in a certain way. I'm not wearing a dress. Y'all are crazy. Everyone Andy. leave me alone. Wild, but, uh, it's wild as hell out there right now. It's, it's crazy. Uh, but uh, welcome in on everyone to the Man Cave 101 podcast where we talk all things nerdy. Obviously live every Thursday, giving you all your dirty needs, trailer reactions, episode reviews, movie reviews, trailer reviews, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, we're just going to kick it off as we always do with the toast. Cheers, everyone. Happy Thursday. Hope everyone is doing well. Is this the last, last, uh, last March podcast? We're going into April now. Yeah, what's going oh, yeah. on? I am, bro. Month four Christmas, of the year. It'll be Christmas again soon, bro. It really is, man. Summer's stop. gonna fly, and I'm gonna stop. cry. Stop, stop. <laughs> stop. stop. Crazy. I, got, I got too much shit to do, man. Don't, don't start this shit. <laughs> right. What are you building out of? Uh, what are you building out of uh, pallets this year? That's the real question. That's the question of the day. I gotta give the hat heads a tour of the backyard once. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> All right, well, as always, we're going to get into our next segment. It's the Comic Corner, where we watch Leo drink, and we love it very <sighs> much. Let's get it. Welcome, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is the Comic Corner. This is where we pick the books that you should pick up for this week. This is going to have first appearances, premiere issues, anything that I think that might be special that you guys should pick up, or even, even the hot cover of the week. So uh, this is where also where I pay for all my sins. No, not like Diddy. So, uh, <laughs> no Diddy. <laughs> so, <Please>. so this <laughs> is not going away anytime soon. No, it's not. It's not. No, it's not going to go. I'm going to ride this like a fucking horse. All right. Uh, hey, so, yo, no whoa. Diddy. <laughs> yeah, no Diddy. <laughs> what the? You got to say. You got to say no Diddy before you say these things. <laughs> yo. What but the? Way, this is where I pay for all my sins. So, anytime that I get an artist names right. On the artist's name's wrong, or <laughs> a writer's name wrong, I have to drink. So please have your pre shots ready because I did this very quickly. <laughs> so, all right. So, first book on the chopping block. Oh, shit. Here we started off freaking all the way over there. God damn it. All right. Leo, Leo does the comic corner now, by the way. So, why it's right. <laughs> you can't I, even I, blame I, me. <laughs> I, I am blaming you still, sir. Okay, so this right. is Incredible Hulk, uh, The Incredible Hulk, number 10. This is has the possible first appearance of the Ghost Detective. This book has three variant covers. Uh, the uh, cover artist is uh, Nick Klein. Klein? 
You got lucky. You got lucky. That's, you got lucky that's, you your, that's definitely your mulligan because that was too. <laughs> well, that's not a mulligan. I just corrected myself two <laughs> seconds later. None of y'all even said that. Uh, writer is Philip <laughs> Philip Kennedy. Uh, the artist is uh, Danny Earls. All right. Uh, next book on the chopping block is Ain't Sam no and Twitch Case Files. Number one. This has one variant cover. Uh, this is a premiere issue. So, and this is also written by Todd, the Todd father, Todd McFarland. Uh, the artist is, uh, yep, uh, Seismon, <laughs> whatever. No. <laughs> 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 Deep in the heart of Texas. Man, listen, it's Wendeezy. How we doing, man? I got here right on time. Right on time. Something said to me, he about to Leo drink. has to drink. He about to drink. <laughs> I was right. This is not right. This is not right. Uh, Se- Seisman Kudransky? Yeah, I, I think it's supposed to be like... like Zemon. It, it's Z- Z- oh, it's probably Zemon. Yeah, <laughs> well, no Diddy. <laughs> That's, you say Zemon? No Diddy, bro. <laughs> hey, and yo. the cover artist is Kevin King. No, right? it's not. No, it's not. What? What is, so what is it? I don't Wait, know. Mateus, what? whatever his name is. You, you put Mateus something. You did. What the fuck? Have you done this before? Oh, I didn't change out the fucking name. Yeah, yep, yeah. I hope you changed out your liquor. <laughs> oh, we're on a great start. We got a great start tonight. Uh, how deep are we? How many? How many wins? Two. Oh, uh, look, there it is. Leo <laughs> emojis oh, in the chat. I love, is. I love how that, that's how the emoji comes up in Streamyard. It's hysterical. <laughs> Who the fuck did that? <laughs> you, you know, it was, you know, it was Rachel. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's, it's all designed, all pretty, and all that. Like I love that. It's hysterical. <sighs> Fantastic! I love it here. Killing the game. Oh God! All right. Next book on the top <laughs> block is X Men ninety seven number one. It's our baby girl rogue. Ooh, this is hey, su- my- hey sugar. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. <laughs> Don't talk to me like that, Aaron. Don't talk to me like no, that. No Diddy, no Diddy, no Diddy. No Diddy. God, we've said Diddy like 38 times, and it's been three minutes. <laughs> All right. A uh, couple artists is Ben Harvey. Uh, uh, artist is Salvador Espin. Uh, writer is Steve Fox. Next book on the chopping block is The Edge of Spider-Verse, The Spooky Man. <laughs> don't ask me about these questions. The Spooky Man. Uh, yeah, so I don't, don't. This has nine variant covers. This has the first appearance of The Spooky Man. Uh, the writer is Kerr Andrews. Uh, the artist is Robert Quinn. Uh, the writer is Rich Duke. No, it's yeah. definitely like Doic or something like that. Yep. Doic sounds right. Yeah. Like you guys don't What's sound confident at all. No, right? dude. No. It's definitely not Duke. It's not, definitely, definitely not Duke. Duke. Definitely, definitely not Duke. Duke. <laughs> definitely not Duke. Oh, the cover artist is Chad Wayne Harden. Nice. What? And I just want to say that the name Spooky Man just has a whole different connotation in 2012. I, I mean, but you're like, you know, it's, it's yeah, it's, 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 it's Spooky Man. Them. What are they going to call him? What are the kids going to call him? Uh, 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 the next book on the chopping block is a new uh, new iteration of, not a new iteration, a new comic book series. Uh, under, new, uh, under York, number one. Uh, this is about a young woman that pursues her family of witches who live underneath New York City and to influence the inhabitants of the surface. Uh, this book has no variant covers. The writer is... Oh. <laughs> is that a... How do you spell that? Salvin Runberg? Berg? No, it's definitely... Salvin... Uh, Salvin... No. Ah, shit. Saldrain? <laughs> Sylvain That's Rumberg. Still, yep. Uh, yeah, that guy. <laughs> uh, the cover artist is... Uh, I was about to say something in Spanish, but... Okay. Uh, Marik, Marik Ald- Adolfo. Mirka? Okay, so it's... Uh, yeah, Mirka. Mirka? 
No, and Dolph, if, if I say it in Spanish, it's a bad word. What <laughs> I just said is a bad word? Right. Yeah, because you've never said anything bad on this, on this channel ever before. No, but if I say it in Spanish, we will get bad. Okay. So I can't literally if it's if it's the same way I looked it up, I looked this one up because I was like, that can't be right. And it's spelled right, and that's what it says. <laughs> so I'm like, I'm not saying oh, right. So you can't say well, I mean you can't say Mirka? Okay, Mirka. It's wrong, but it's Mirka. There you go. That's fine. Fine. So the last name? Adolfo. No, Andolfo? Adolfo. And Andolfo. <laughs> Motherfucker, it's Spanish. And 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 then and then and then. Ooh, that's my car. Let's go. Next, next book on the topic block is Marvel Gods. Uh, this is issue number six. This has uh, this series actually has been great because it has shows you a lot of the more high power gods and a lot of that Marvel characters haven't we haven't seen before. So I suggest you pick up all six that so far out. Um, the artist is Velio uh, Shititi. <laughs> what? Again? Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. What's this? I just wanted to drink. <laughs> <laughs> cover, cover artist is Rod Reese. Uh, the, uh, <clears throat> the writer is uh, Jonathan Hinkman. Fantastic. And that does it for the Comic Corner, ladies and gents. Uh, we had to drink, what, six times? Seven? Seven times? Honestly, it was a good week. It was a good it's week. Solid, it's a solid week. It's a solid yeah, week. I'll, I'll honestly take this. A solid, a solid seven, me drinking seven times. Yeah, it was great. Yeah. Uh, so that does it for the Comic Corner. So like we always say, support your local comic book shops. Your addiction is comic books and a lot of alcohol at this moment. You heard Leo. Support your addictions. Yes. <laughs> the good ones. Especially, the yeah, the good ones. ones. But, um, yeah. but no all right, that's, that's the comic corner. Yeah, no ditty. <laughs> no ditty. <laughs> We're going to have a no ditty count today. So I Yeah, we no should. Ditty. So that's six. Sixteen. Okay. It's like seven. It's Fantastic. like seven D. Uh, God, all right, but cheers, yeah. everyone. Let's go to the uh, let's go to the nerdy news. What's going on out there? All right, uh, uh, hang on, wait, wait, wait. We got some comments. Hold on. First mm. off, Torian said, "Leo, put your glasses back on." Nice. Here, yeah. <laughs> Love, Here, that. Yeah. <laughs> Love that. Love that. Another note: People in my chat a couple of days ago asked about you guys from the time they saw Ooh. I was on your channel last year. I told them I still stay in contact with you every week. We nice. love that. We love that. So we love that. Thank you, sir. Do it. And Do it. that's it. Other than that. Leo drink. Drink, Leo drink, 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 drink. Rachel, we'll have a conversation. <laughs> I don't think you're gonna say anything if you want empanadas. Not a yeah. word. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't even say Bam. it. I just. <laughs> yeah, you don't need to say it. Shots nope. fired. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Shots fired. <laughs> Oh, that's foul. No diddy, no diddy, no FC, no Einstein. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Okay. okay. Next. <laughs> okay. Anthony Mackey, Anthony Mackey confirms that Sebastian Stan and Daniel Bro. Bro? Yeah, bro. Daniel Bro won't appear in Captain America The Brave New World. When they decided to go back to the movie, it it was what it is. It was what it is. I don't know why the fuck he said that, but I don't have my friends anymore, so it's kind of uh, dampens the mood a little bit. Wait, I'm sorry. They're not going to be in the movie? No, not for that long. Maybe one scene. I mean, I kind of, I kind of figured sure. that because it's a Captain America movie. So, I mean, we don't have to have we don't have to have Winter Soldier in every Captain America movie at this point. He's already I mean, been in a project. It's a Winter Soldier, man. Like I, I know, I get it, but now he's in the Thunderbolts, right? So yeah, but, I mean, but he just makes <laughs> things better. He does he? Well, eh, it's debatable. <laughs> <laughs> really debatable. I, 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 I love. I don't get me wrong. I love Winter Soldier, but like at this point, we've seen him a lot. You know what I mean? Like he's been in a lot of projects that he's just a side character, and so it's like. And now he's going to be a side character in Thunderbolts. So, like, yeah. I don't need to see him every year. You know what I mean? That's he can just cool. pop up randomly. 
You no, know, or the, the the scene you'll see them in is at the end when he becomes the white wolf. <laughs> I'm actually okay with that though. I'm good with that. All right. Uh, the world's only Dragon Ball theme park has been announced. It's going to be in Saudi Arabia. Man Cave Road Trip. Gonna, if anybody's going to do it, it'll be them. Man Cave Road Trip. Like I seen oh, the pic. I seen the. I, I seen <laughs> what looked like the pictures that they're trying to draw up. Like it looks kind of dope. <laughs> Yeah, it does. It, look look, it looked kind of dope, like the concept. Yo, where, where's, the, where's, where's the theme park? Saudi. Dragon Ball, Saudi Arabia. Dope. Because, Saudi Arabia. because of course it is. Yeah, yeah, because they have the money. Well, it's got the money to build it. <laughs> exactly, and the land. <laughs> uh, Dennis Villalubo. Villalubi. What? Yeah, I don't know. Let's just see what the story's about. <laughs> Says if Doom Three <laughs> isn't better than Doom Two, I I don't do it. So basically, question, the question is: Is Dune is Dune Popcorn Bucket Two going to be better than Dune Popcorn Bucket One? <laughs> I mean, I think have to ask the no. people. Oh, only yes. oh, no. we, 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 we have we have Dune Bucket Dune Bucket Two was the one that we we always love. <laughs> All of us love. True. It'll only be better if she brings a friend. You, you know what? You know what I want to know? Because I I was thinking about this the other day randomly. I wonder if. If Ryan Reynolds trolls us with a popcorn bucket after that Doom bucket came out for Deadpool, Deadpool three, that Honestly, would be hilarious. I'd be disappointed if he that would did. be hilarious. Just FYI, like if he just did something completely trolly, it would be perfect of him to do that. But I feel like Ryan Reynolds is the one to like literally put out a Deadpool like fleshlight though, like just to fuck with everyone. Like he would do some <laughs> crazy shit like that. You know he would. Yeah, uh, he really um... would. I mean, he did say pegging in the trailer. Just saying. You know he would. <laughs> he did do it for the year of the dog. Uh, he's gonna come uh, out with it. Uh, he's gonna come uh, out with a Deadpool hot dog. That's what's uh, gonna happen. Uh, 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 uh. Yo, All right. Uh, by by the way, uh, Sean with the ten dollar donation. Why, like, thank you, oh, man. You, you, Dude, this, thank you so much, man. Thank you so much. We we appreciate it. We God, appreciate it. That's awesome, man. Fantastic. Um, hey, how you doing tonight, Sean? By the way, I've really been thoroughly enjoying the trailer reactions, particularly the ones that I send because I don't, I don't send you no mid. Uh, Sean said no, no city. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Uh, Ryan, Ryan Reynolds will come out with a popcorn shooter that says "Open Wide" on the shaft. Yeah, <laughs> yep. Yep. Uh, yeah, he probably will though. Honestly, if there was ever a no Diddy situation. Mm. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. Uh, CBS in real world news: CBS signs a two billion dollar deal with Dave Chappelle for new late night TV show. Really? Wait. Wait. So a late night TV show? It's not like a sketch comedy, like he a host on a talk show. I think so. Like a like a Dave Letterman type of deal. <laughs> I think so, bro. That would be nuts. Who who's gonna go talk to Dave Chappelle and get roasted for like a half hour? Me, I mean, me. Hell yeah. Yeah, you yeah. think so? Man Cave yeah. One on One podcast gonna go on no, that, that show. That would be crazy. <laughs> I'll get roasted for hours if <laughs> I can be next no. to Dave Chappelle. <laughs> Make all kind of goddamn jokes. <laughs> all right. Uh, Eyes of Wakanda animated series will be canon to the MCU's scar scarred timeline. Okay. Timeline sacred yeah. is it sacred oh, or scarred? No, oh, sacred. Sorry, Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, fucking... Lord. Leo, you are not... killing me tonight, man. <laughs> Dude, I am not in the right hands for this right now. So, eyes of Wakanda, so eyes of Wakanda is yeah, part of part of the like the real MC, the MCU. Yeah, yes. that's what they're saying. So, what I want to know oh, that I, th- th- all right, we're gonna get into X Men later, but I want to know if X Men is also. Because it would only make a lot of sense to me if it was. I don't think so. Yeah, no, because so, it seems no. like it seems like the X Men are on a uh, they're, they're in a different uh, what you call them uh, multiverse. Yeah, they're, they're, so, they're in maybe seven one two. Yeah, I, like I get, this, yeah, I guess I ju- I guess I just find it interesting because like I don't know why. Well, spoilers. I don't know why. They're gonna double dip sinister. I'm gonna have that question from now until live action X Men comes out. I don't know why we're double dipping on Mister Sinister for for live action and and cartoon. Like I, I don't love that to be honest with you. Seems like a lot, but no, eh, neither here nor there. Talk about it later if you want. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, the Joker. No. No. <laughs> just just no. <laughs> to be a Jupiter. 
box musical featuring 15 well-known songs. <laughs> and, <laughs> and after reading that news, I am off the deep end as well. Ga ga ooh la la, watch out for romance. Bruh, I knew that this whole shit was gonna be a goddamn musical. I knew it the whole time, the whole time. They just took this Joker, this this fantastic side Joker that we have here in DC Elseworlds, Else Worlds, and now they made it shit. They added Lady Gaga and made it a musical, and now Not it's dude, all gone to shit. I, I know how the movie starts, right? It starts, I, you know, yeah, we, you? We, yeah, I do. I know how the movie starts. Mm. Starts black screen. You get the spotlight around the Joker playing a guitar. Uh-huh. Tell me something, girl. Oh, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> no, he didn't. I hope so. That's how I it's, really and honestly, if hope it's, so. If it starts like that, I'll sit through the movie. No. I will. <laughs> Just because it started no. like that, I will. All right. All right. Joker or Venom 3? Which one are you going to see first? Oh, oh. <laughs> I would probably sit through Joker. I'll sit through Venom. I, oh, 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 really? Uh, I wouldn't. I would sit through Joker. I, I, it's really hard because we know more about Joker than we do Venom, I'm, right? Look, like, under my head, if I had to go, I'd go to Joker. You, you go to yeah, Joker? I would go to Joker. I, I, go to, I don't mind music so much. So that's so bad. I don't mind music so much. Yeah, but I mean, in Venom's defense, to be fair, this Joker doesn't even act like a Batman villain, right? So, like, you know, Venom's not a Spider-Man villain, right? So Because there's no Batman in this universe, because he'll kill the Batman in this universe. I would still choose to go see Joker. Well, uh, I know uh, I know what Aaron's going to see, because he now um, has no choice. Babe, <laughs> I, I love you so much. I'm not going to see Venom 3. I promise you. I'm wait, not going wait, to see wait, Venom wait, 3. Wait, wait, what was the comment, man? You just put it she, up and just take it off. Rachel, 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 Rachel loves Venom. Oh, well. So she wants to go see Venom. I'm not going to see Venom 3. I'm not. I'm not you're not going to get me to sit through that. There's no way. I will. Rachel, if you get to see Venom. <laughs> Please yeah. you, you, you're gonna come see Deadpool twice potentially. <laughs> that's actually very nice. So you know, okay. I don't think that's a bad time. That's crazy. All right. In Wendell news, Happy Uh-oh. Gilmore, Happy Gilmore Two is officially in the works. It's fucking Shooters Tour, baby. Shooters <laughs> Tour, baby. <laughs> shooters my Tour, baby. Up, hey, Shooter, you want to go to the Sizzler and grab some grub? <laughs> <laughs> Do you eat pieces of shit for breakfast? <laughs> no, no. Three three hundred sixty four more days till next year's hockey tryouts. I gotta toughen up. Oh, there's so many memorable lines. Like, God yeah. damn it, I'm so excited. Did you see? Did you see? Did anybody else see Adam Adam Sandler? Like, he did. He actually did the the Happy Gilmore thing on a golf course the other day. He just yeah, recorded really? himself doing the fucking. Yeah. <laughs> Why not? I was like, "Yo, this is classic. This is classic." Uh, well, I want to. I want to give a. I want to give a shout out to this groupie. Uh, Ten dollar donation for Venom. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> well, she now you have to. Go. She just paid me. <laughs> I was gonna say you could have just go, you could have you could have paid for the ticket. Rachel, at that point. I don't know if you know ticket prices. You also need uh, about twenty more dollars mm-hmm. to fully pay for that ticket. Yeah. <laughs> But thank you. It's going to pay for the sus venom popcorn bucket that comes. <laughs> <laughs> Michaela hi, also Michaela. says hi, guys. Hi, Michaela. Hey, Michaela. Hey, Michaela. Gonna, that's, that popcorn bucket is going to be the real 19 inches of venom. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no diddy. Oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Wow. Things are escalating. Do you want us to leave the room so you can have a moment? No. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Spider-Man 2 fast travel was almost cut because it totally broke our game. Yeah, but thank God they figured it out because the fast travel is sick in that game. It's abs- it's ridiculous. They almost cut it? Yeah. Yep. Interesting. Think about how fast it is. Like it's it's like it's not even it's instantaneous. Like you just like you're just loading part of the game, right? Can I tell you though, just remembering I barely used it because yeah. I just wanted to I just I wanted, wanted to, to fly around the city. I enjoy going through the city. I, and, and especially playing. especially since they did those those speed boost things. Yeah. With the, I was like, yo, this is fucking great. I, I think I used the fast travel once, maybe. Yeah, yeah, I don't dude. even know. Oh. I, 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 need, I, I need DLC. How, I was far, literally, how far away are me? I was literally just about to say we need this DLC, man. I'm dying out here. How far away are we from fucking DLC? Insomniac, hey, dude, talk to me. It's gotta be it's gotta be <laughs> it's gotta be fall or winter. Has to uh, be. Have either of you picked it up though? 
I what? haven't yet. I want to jump back in and check out the new suits. I haven't even grabbed the new yeah, suits. Yeah, I yet. haven't. I haven't done yeah. um, Game nope. Plus. All right. Uh, Star Wars, the Acolyte character, has a lightsaber that turns into a whip. Light whip. What? Well, which which character? The uh, Jedi, uh, Jedi Master uh, Venenos, Venenestra? Is that the... The girl with the... Uh, is another uh, green baby with purple hair. Yeah, I don't think I, I, don't think I like the, that. The, not, yeah, she's going to have a whip. Not the, not the month after the Black History Month. <laughs> I don't know about that, bro. <laughs> also, yep. it's, also, it's a direct, direct ripoff of Demon Slayer, just saying. Yeah. Sword yeah, that turns into a whip. Same, yeah. same, the, same fucking the whip, thing. The whip will probably be purple, too. Ooh. Hey, yo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Right. Anyway, anyway uh, I have a serious question, though, because I, I actually I haven't really watched back. Did you guys actually? Are you excited? Is there excitement for Acolyte? Question mark? No, I mean, not really. You got Trinity. Why not? I'm cool right. about it. I, I don't on. mind. Catch but dude, it's it's it funny. Work. So the acolyte, though, I think it's like um, the thumbs up versus thumbs down. Like I think there's more thumbs down on the um, the Star Wars posted um, trailer on their official page, and there are thumbs up, which is crazy. Really, dude, the Star Wars fandom is the most toxic mother effers on this planet. Yeah, but it goes it goes back how far? You know what I mean? Like I feel like that's why I feel like you, you have so uh, many the, the generations prequels, of Star Wars. Goes, fans, you know what I mean? It goes like, yeah, but it really like the prequels really kind of started it, like with like you know mm, the Hayden Christensen of it all. And I don't did know. you see Attack of the Clones? Did you see it? Did you actually amazing, watch Attack of the Clones? How that works. Yeah. Have you have you heard of Jar Jar Binks by any chance? The mm. best fucking Star Wars character ever. <laughs> I just I just don't know how like you know because we always we we bullshit all the time about how like. You know, everything is so quote unquote. I'm gonna put in air quotes woke. I don't know how Star Wars deals with that because you have fans that date back so far. So I feel like because of the generation of fans, like everybody's gonna have an issue. Like you're never gonna please the entire Star Wars mm -hmm. fandom, like ever. Because ever. everybody's from different generations and walks of life at this point, <laughs> dating how far back it is. So it's like you're never gonna make everybody happy. I mean, I don't you guys can agree with me. I feel like the prequels got crapped on, but I really did like episode three though, and I love Darth Vader. Like three. I, I liked episode three. I don't know. Call me crazy, but no, um, everybody like that. That yeah, you had to pick one out of the first three. Right, of course. Yeah. Episode three. And I just I, I liked Darth Maul. Everyone just wanted more. Hence, hence uh, the Attack of the Clones animated series. Why that happened? Because they knew they can fit Darth Maul in there. But um, I really think like when the Force Awakens came out, like everyone was a little hype. It was obviously just like a New Hope 2.0, which is fine. But then like the Last Jedi came out, and it was just. It was a wrap. There was one in between there, wasn't there? Huh? Uh, well, that was um, Rogue One. Rogue One was amazing. No, no, no. There was three movies in the end, wasn't there? No, Last Jedi was the middle one. Then it was, um, um, uh, what is it, the Skywalker? Oh, um, yeah, okay. Yeah, whatever. See how forgettable that was? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> by, by the way, uh, we got some comments here. Torian said, speaking Spider-Man, I heard that Spider-Verse, the Spider Within short film is, very, is really good. Uh, mm -hmm. We will be doing a pre-record of that after this uh where we, we're probably going to break down the entire thing with our comments sony i have a gripe and i'm going to talk about it when we do the trailer too or the, the full the full thing um That's they, so they, they, they they posted it as a fundraiser i have a i have a real problem with that just Is fyi that so but we can get into that that's later, so weird. But, like we usually don't have gripes with Sony. It's so odd. But I mean, so, so, Sony's out here hungry for money because they ain't getting any from their movies. So they're just putting everything out here as a fucking fundraiser. So yeah, you know, I mean, did you see, did you see Madam Web? And the answer was no. You know, we didn't. See I, well, no one saw I Madam. Web. <laughs> wait, you did? A, wait, you actually saw it? You watched the whole thing, yeah. Leo? Tell tell me you have any good takeaways from this movie that don't start with Sydney Sweeney. Aha! <laughs> All right. What's the next bit of news? <clears throat> God, I'll wait. God, I'll wait. <laughs> I actually like the villain. Oh stop, my God, stop, he, stop. he was it. He, he was in the movie like for like five minutes, villain? wasn't he? No, no, no. I heard he was in the movie heard, for like barely any I time. His, I heard his voice was terrible though. Like it was clearly chopped up and like put together. Nah. nah. I don't know. I I'm not gonna lie to you. Of everything I've seen about the movie. I haven't seen the villain one time in any social media post. Nothing. I haven't even seen him. Don't even know he exists. Didn't even know. Still don't know his name, to be completely honest with you. What is his name? <laughs> What's his name, Leo? Tell us that. What? 
Ultimate you, want the guy that, you know you want the guy that's notorious bad with names. You want me to fucking guess his name out of the fucking world? How is his name? You watched the movie. Uh, like I'm gonna fucking remember. Um three weeks gotcha. ago. Who's the Ezekiel Sims? There you Ezekiel go. Me. That's oh, such that a is. memorable villain. Hmm. Uh, hey, it's hey, it's Kiki. Has there been any news on a Wolverine game? Yeah, they're not making it fast enough. That's yeah, the update. Uh, <laughs> so, <of> obviously, <laughs> I, uh, Kiki, I don't know if you saw, but there was obviously a very big leak from that game uh, that a lot of uh, a lot of people put out. Uh, they tried to hold um, what is it, Insomniac ransom, but they refused to pay, so they leaked a bunch of stuff. Got it. Uh, the, so I think the last thing a whole bunch of shit now. Well, yeah, and the and the last thing we heard was just that Insomniac made like some official announcement that they're still moving forward with the game, and you know we you know we're hard at work at it, and <laughs> the game's gonna be a banger. So because better? based on that leak, it's already like partially done. Why would you not move forward with right? It? Yeah, like there's no. The <laughs> who, do you, who do you think you are, DC? <laughs> right. <laughs> are you no, we're gonna we're gonna back this. We're gonna we're gonna back all this. That's the term. <laughs> Did you see that melanated woman in the trailer? I'm, I'm presuming you you mean acolyte. Why? What's not to be excited for? At least for me. Okay, see, but I don't know, man. <laughs> mm. trailer, I don't know. I saw got, Trinity. That's all I needed to see. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, Carry on, lost. I'm good. A Trinity. lot of these complaining about Star Wars are, grif are uh, grifting for money and views. I mean, mm. yeah. not wrong. Mm. Not wrong. Not wrong. Not wrong. Mm. All right, Wonder Man series will still consist of ten episodes. They're still doing this thing. They are, dude. I like the like. Nah, you I, want to I, a whole bunch of stuff. Listen, Wonder Man is a sacrificial lamb. There is zero need is. to have tell his story. Zero needs to tell his story. The only like thing they get out of says, you'll make it you'll make uh the something else. You'll make white dog shit vision regular vision again probably like that's, that's probably what you're gonna that's his existence that's what he's right. there for yeah now we get now we get to bring bring back my brother vision bring him back <laughs> with some color, with some color. <laughs> Marvel zombies all these flavors guys you had to choose salty <laughs> uh salutations my brother vision <laughs> Marvel Zombies will be an intense TVMA animated series. It better be. TVMA, that's good. Yeah, uh, freaking X Men has restored my faith in 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 Marvel animation. I mean, Thank don't God. get too happy. Thank God. I, I, but yeah, but I like I like the first Marvel Zombies, but I also like the first the first What If and okay. yeah, fair, okay. fair, fair. Cool. Okay, all right, all right, cool, 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 cool. 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 gotcha. All right. All right, cool. We still gotcha. doing good because the second what if only had three good episodes. So that's, that's my point. Three out of three out three? of what ten? Three out of ten? How many was it? Eight, ten? I forget. Ever. I don't even I know how many it was. It's still, no. it's still a small number too against a large number. Yeah. I mean, I, I didn't think season two was gonna hold up against season one, regardless of what it did. Season one was too good, I feel like. Nope. I was expecting them to do better. Nah, I didn't think they would. All I needed to see was Happy Hogan Saves Christmas, and I already knew. Like, I was like, this is an L automatic. This is automatic. Hold this L. All right. Uh, Tom Holland's Peter, Peter Parker will reportedly be start fading away in the MCU. No, he won't. Okay. In his mind, Peter Parker is no more, but Spider-Man lives on. As the title of the Spider-Man continues to consume Peter Parker's life and a little bit of Peter Parker every time he puts on the suit. Mm -hmm. I mean, so they pretty much did like the comics backwards, right? Because he like started as the neighborhood Spider-Man, then went into the Avengers, then got the iron suit. And they, they kind of just did it backwards, right? So now he had the iron suit. Now he's going to go be the friendly neighborhood Spider-Man and start from scratch with like his own sewn up suit, right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. That sounds right. Pretty much. I mean, didn't we... Didn't we kind of see that from Tom Holland Spider Man? Because he, if it wasn't for, if it wasn't for, uh, freaking God damn it, not Andrew. <laughs> if it wasn't for, um, <laughs> who the fuck am I thinking of? Go ahead, man. Take your time. I can't think of his name. I'm fucking shot. Anyway, wow. um, but at the end of at the end of No Way Home, he almost didn't stop him from killing Goblin. So Toby Maguire. Thank you, Toby. That oh. fucking hell. Mm -hmm. Couldn't couldn't get Toby. Couldn't get Toby out. You should drink bed. for that. It's sure. One. Drink your water. It's hot quality H two O. Well, Mama's wrong again. 
<laughs> Mama said alligators are ornery because of them. Because they, got all the teeth and, they got they got all that teeth and no toothbrush. And no toothbrush. <laughs> Oh yeah. Uh, Walmart agrees. Uh, real world news. Walmart agrees to forty-five million class action lawsuit settlement payout. Uh, oh. The payout may be up to five hundred dollars each. Well, each Walmart's person. wrong what? again. <laughs> but they do uh, because they overcharge. Sometimes they're overcharging in self checkout. Sometimes they're not charging in self checkout, and people got arrested. So they did a class action lawsuit, and that's why you see in a lot of WalMarts now they're going to get rid- they're getting rid of the self checkout because they're losing uh, too much money. Not no, they're not just getting rid of. They're not getting rid of self checkout. <laughs> they're making people pay a membership to use self checkout, yes. which is which is which freaking is freaking insane. Crazy. But oh. here's the here's the thing though, and I'm gonna predict this right now. This is gonna be like the Netflix subscription thing where they made everyone like. I'm telling you right now, they're gonna make a ton of money. They're gonna make a ton of money doing it because people are about convenience. And then everyone that has a self checkout is gonna do the same shit. You watch. So I, I, I just, just want to make sure I understand this. So, you were robbing people. Yep. But now, what you're going to do is let them volunteer to let you rob them. Yep. Yeah. Okay. I just wanted to make sure I got that right. Yep. So, dude, LP uh, loss prevention one on one. Don't cherry pick self checkout, man. Come on, you know you're going to get got. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm going to have a membership in order, so I'm going to volunteer to let the right. same. Right. And you know what's sick. Before. Wow. You know what's gonna you know what's sick? They're yeah, gonna make course. millions of dollars doing it, and then, then they're then they're gonna get the insurance money from all the inventories that they mess up. <coughs> None of us have worked uh retail uh loss prevention, nope. by the way. Damn, I, I didn't even think about it. I didn't even think about it like that. Damn, that is never tipping, huh? You just fucking get away with that. Right. And <laughs> I'm telling you right now, they're gonna it's gonna be a Netflix situation. Just You're gonna have huh. no choice. They're gonna win, they're gonna, they're gonna have and, one one cashier. Yep, all yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yep. And they'll have <laughs> they'll have 30 <laughs> self checkouts. <laughs> Sorry. I'll go to Walgreens. I'm not fucking. <laughs> it's Walgreens. okay. Wal- <laughs> Listen, Walgreens will be a year behind them. Don't worry. Mm. They got you. Stop right. and shop. Got you. I guess I'm going to order my shit online because I'm not paying this shit. They can kiss my ass. I've been shopping. It's all right. Oh, $58 delivery fee. I go off the grid. <laughs> oh, <laughs> grow your own. <laughs> grow your own. <laughs> I'm grow my own food. Own grow. <laughs> grow my own toothpaste. I don't need you. All right. Um, this uh, this question was asked on the internet, on the interwebs. So I wanted to ask you guys this: in our group right here, five inches. Stop! 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 What the fuck is wrong what with you? you? No, Diddy. What the no, fuck, bro? <laughs> From the I floor, just, I just but you know Aaron. Aaron left. I had to. It, it was too. It was right there. You like handed it to me on a silver platter, and it just. What, I had the, to, what the fuck? I had, to, I had to do something. It was too funny not to do something. Okay. I'm sorry. Continue. All right. So, uh, if we were all in a horror movie, who would die first? First, wait. The oh, chat. I mean the chat. Who would die of all of us five here? Oh, who would Lord. die first if we're you. going against Jason? I mean, yeah, are, we, are we yeah, going Jason. based off? Are we going based off of um, horror horror movie rules? Because if we're going off horror movie rules, I'm gonna outlast all of you. Bullshit! Bullshit! <laughs> <laughs> oh, because black. <laughs> 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 Come on, it was uh, you hey, you're giving it to me on this platter. I'm just saying, like, listen, I ain't gotta be faster than Jason, I just gotta be faster than you. Yep. I would say if this was a zombie apocalypse, I'm clearly the one that goes first. But horror movie, I got a good shot at number one. I I have a follow-up question. Are we drunk? <laughs> it, makes things, it makes things more interesting. Just saying. Yeah. Was, was, <laughs> was Mama like, were we drinking? And then just Jason popped up in, like we in were, your yard and was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. what up, in, bitches? I'm here. And, 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 <laughs> yeah, we were, yeah, we were drinking in the backyard and Jason pops up out of the bushes. <laughs> Who's dying first? Right. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I think Jason would because I, I think Jason's dying. We need to beat his ass. I think he would run to your friend. I think he'd run to the pool. He, I, I was gonna say he might, he might get bum rushed. Not he's, uh, <laughs> he's going. Uh, 
<laughs> he's going head first into the fire pit. Like, that's exactly where he's going. He he you, and you know how I get around that fire pit, bro. <laughs> plus, plus, you got like you got like eagles and wildlife and shit out there. I don't know if he's making it to us. He might not even make it past. He might not make it past the raccoons and shit. I don't know, man. <laughs> you got raccoons the size of dogs out by you, man. I don't know about all that shit. <laughs> oh, raccoon update. Did Bluey? you get the bastard? I got the bastard. Blue ass is dead. Oh, wait. Did bitch. I? Was this a last week thing? Did I miss a raccoon situation? No, 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 no. <laughs> no this, this was like yeah. a, a couple, uh, like six months ago. Blue is dead. Oh, I missed this. <laughs> now I'm going after his cousins. Got his ass, huh? There <laughs> yeah. You go. There you go. Green ass. Green ass. I'm on the hunt for you. If I find you, I'm going to fuck you up. <laughs> <laughs> but who's dying first? Come on. Let's get it. Well, I mean, I know, I know, I know. Torian's vote. But, uh, <laughs> don't be mad. Don't be mad because I'm honest. Don't be mad. <laughs> See, but my scenario presents a lot of things because I'm, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm do I need ch- cardio? Do I need? I'm if g- I need cardio, I'm first. Like that's it. I'm. I'm it's a wrap. <laughs> I've been on my cardio, on my cardio news, game lately. I've been on my cardio game lately. Just saying. <laughs> Bro, Aaron does like 45 minutes on the Stairmaster every time he goes to the gym. Yo, he's outlasting all of us. I'm telling you right now. It's not even a question of like 45 minutes every time. I, do. I, might, I, might, I might have a shot. I'm at least gonna, I'm at least going to run distraction because I know Leo's got something in the house. <laughs> I'll, just, I'll, just, I'll let Leo get to the house and just distract his ass for a little while. Just run around the circles, man. Just run around five minutes. a little bit. He's slow. Man. He moves, he moves, he moves at one speed. You know what I mean? Like, here we go. Here we go. Give me four and a half minutes. I have yeah, Leo, Leo's, going, Leo's going first because he didn't practice playing hard games on live stream. <laughs> <laughs> We, him, we, 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 we do have to get Leo to stream a hard game. It would be hilarious. Leo, that's, Leo, all, that's content you, gold. You have to do it, bro. I want it to be like Resident Evil 10. Oh, yeah. You gotta, you gotta play it on, on, a, on a big joint in the dark. Leo, <laughs> Leo, the other night I was getting hammered, pinning people, and going one, two. Like, I, come on. just You just gotta do it. <laughs> get it, man. No. My nightmares would be fucking ridiculous. <laughs> John, Johnny Fish, what up? Johnny Fish. Fish. Uh, Johnny Fish. It said when Dell got possums the size of sumo wrestlers around him, he's not wrong. It's not yeah, wrong. Not Everything wrong. in Texas, bro. Wrong. Everything in Texas. Oh. <laughs> uh, All right. Uh, so, guys in the chat, give us your answer. You give us your scenario and let us know. Uh, all right. Um, Marvel wants to turn World War Hulk. World War Hulk into an Avengers film. You mean because that. you mean because uh, yeah. because the Hulk will never get a solo film as per Kevin yeah. Feige. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so they have to make it Avengers I mean, World War Hulk. Listen, <laughs> only if, only if She Hulk's in it. Stop. <laughs> Stop. So don't even play like that. I guess it just costs so much. It costs too much to actually like use the Hulk on screen. Is, is that what the, this is? I mean, but how much Hulk, how much screen time did Hulk get in Endgame? Uh, not a lot. Not, he got one uh, point. He didn't even get a scene. Not, you know, in the he, game, he, he, no, he did. Yeah, he, did. He, he, he snapped, remember? He, he did the first snap. Oh, yeah, 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 he about was that. in the yeah. truck. Like, he was on the screen. And then he did this whole whiny Hulk thing where he threw a bench yeah. after he found out about Matt. Like he was, he was, the, he was in it for a decent amount of time. Yo, but then, yo, he got Nat though. Huh? That, that's that's a, he got Black Widow though. That's a skill. Yo, that's a Scarlett Johansson. What? I mean, he, I mean, sun's getting real low, big guy. I don't know. It doesn't. It doesn't. doesn't. At the end of the day, we all have weaknesses. He got Green Man. He got Green Man Riz, man. Green Man Riz. <laughs> We all got weaknesses. You know what I mean? Like. <laughs> Hulk Hulk had 20 minutes of screen time in Endgame versus the next Damn. closest, which is Thor's 21 minutes, 15 seconds, followed by Captain America, 30 minutes, followed by Iron Man, 34 minutes. And those huh. are the most, yeah. Huh. Yeah, I so mean, Hulk was in the movie for a pretty decent amount of time. Yeah, I mean, he was top five. Yeah. So... And the amount of money they would make on a Hulk film. Oh, are you serious? <laughs> like, come <laughs> on. Then, yo, moving into Maestro? I, I don't... I don't... See, I kind of, I kind of disagree with you guys. I really I think, I think we would love a Hulk movie, 
but the way that they've set up the Hulk in the MCU, he's not that popular. That's I'm telling you. Okay. That's why you do I'm, this. I'm, that's yeah. why you do this and flip I, I get this bitch all the way yeah. around. Okay, let's, let's be clear. We're, we're not talking about Dominican Hulk. Nope. I, no, but, that, that, but, that, but that's but that's the bird. That's the, that, there's nothing what? wrong with it. He likes Mama Juana. I, Mama it's Juana, great. I love it for him. A tank top. We got you. I don't, I don't think but, I'm going to find any chocolate to fit him. I'm just saying. I think. I think. Yeah, Jesus Sandals in the. I think I think this this generation of Marvel fans is so used to Hulk in a tank top, Hulk speaking, Hulk like yeah, he, he's I, not. We're, we're not. We're they're not. They don't. They're not used to Maestro or yeah, Gray yeah. Hulk or what, what's the Hulk in the suit? What's the, the but my, but uh, Maestro, you know what I mean? Maestro like, does speak. Hulk. Maestro speaks. Maestro speaks. Maestro speaks yeah. yeah, but I just I just I don't, I don't, he's a smart. Yeah, but, he's a smart yeah, but I don't. You're looking. Joe fix it. Joe fix it. That, that's what I'm thinking of. Like, like they're not they're not used to that Hulk. They're used to this Hulk, who's like a little bit more timid and couldn't control his powers. And like, bro, that's, I mean, like I'm that's who flip them on their ears, bro. Listen, I, I, I get it. I, the Hulk has been around entirely too long and is a favorite character of young kids because he's very simple to digest. He's green, he's big, he's strong, he fucking he says, smashes. Hulk smash, and he smashes everything. Every kid understands that. Yep. Yeah, like listen, the, people like Spider Man. He climbs on the walls. and get it. Every kid digests Hulk very easily because he yeah. smashes shit. I get it. You can put I, the I, story in there for the adults, but as listen. long as he's breaking shit every like ten to fifteen minutes, yeah, you can take your kids there because they not they don't care about the story. They just yeah. want to see him smash. smash. Like, oh shit, he picked that up. Oh, he picked <laughs> I mean, like at the end of the day, you made. You made two shit Thor films. You can't tell me you can't produce one good Hulk film. Like there ain't no fucking way. That's you you can make man. a good Hulk film. I just don't know that it would make the money that I think Marvel thinks it would. I think it. I, I think that's what will. I'm trying to say. Like I, I, I don't think know if it maybe would. there may be some lamenting, like you're saying. But yeah. once people start seeing it, that shit'll pop off like Iron Man did. <clears throat> I think. I think if Marvel can find a way to take the Hulk we have now. And get him to the point that he becomes World War Hulk in some upcoming projects, like to that level of Hulk, that different, like not the Hulk we're used to the past couple fucking years, and they could turn it, like make him the fucking wrecking machine that you want him to be. Then I think you could make the fucking movie and be like, all right, cool. You know what I mean? But they they just gotta have him snap one time, and then shit him off. And then like he disappears for like a couple of films, and then the next time you see him. All right, uh, Scarlett Johansson upcoming Jurassic City role. Oh has Lord, passed, has <laughs> passed on, passed on by Jennifer Lawrence. So Jennifer Lawrence was supposed to be the main actress. Honestly, and Scarlett thank Johansson God. took it up. Black Widow v Jurassic Park. I'm in. Yep, that's what we're gonna get. <sighs> Wait, sorry, we had some comments. Hulk <laughs> said the flesh is weak. <laughs> uh, because because they bitched him out. They yeah, they sure bitched out the Hulk. Out. That's, that's what it is. A real Hulk film. Yeah, a real Hulk. Film. Real Hulk film. That's what's needed. Real Hulk. Yeah. <laughs> when Dell's so enthused about this movie, he can barely contain himself. Jurassic Park. <laughs> <by this. laughs> I mean, look. I'm, how are we I'm still going over, with this Jurassic Park though? I'm, I'm over Jurassic movies, man. Like it's right up there with Fast. Just get rid of the whole thing. Just <laughs> I want the whole thing gone. I want family gone. I want dinosaurs gone. I want all the shit gone. Get the fuck out of here. I'm over it. <laughs> she's a Damn, di- she's, she's a dino snack. <laughs> she is though. <laughs> she <laughs> is though. All right, uh, Haley uh, Haley Atwell, Captain Captain Carter, will Can reportedly it? be. What he said. You address, you address her properly. You address her properly. It's Captain, it's Captain Cannon, yes, God yes. damn it. <laughs> Get it right. Captain Cannon will reportedly be one, one of the characters to play in Avengers Secret Wars. Oh, I love Which that. Be. <laughs> I love that. The hell? Wow. Uh, just, I was just looking up real quick. Um, Captain Cannon's? Um, Public domain for for the Hulk is two thousand and fifty eight. Oh, <laughs> wait, wait, what? The, the, you know, Whoa. after a while, these characters all become public domain. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Make, I just was yeah. curious, like when. So I just looked it up, but like the Hulk, the Hulk and uh, Spider Man both become public domain in two thousand fifty eight. I'll be seventy one. And and we're gonna, going we're to gonna, the movies to we're gonna get together and just fucking make a Hulk movie. <laughs> I think I, I can wait till then. <laughs> Jesus oh, Christ! Shit. 
All right. Mm -hmm. uh, the working title for Gen V season two is Nero, teasing the return of Black Noir. Ah, oh, I love I love Black Noir, bro. Bro, <laughs> they, 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 I love Black Noir, bro. They gotta do him right, bro. They gotta they gotta do they gotta do black they gotta do him right, bro. Dude, I'm so upset that the boys is not coming till June. Why? Yeah. Because I want it now. What do you mean, why? Yeah. yeah, yeah, but you know what? There's there's a lot of stuff out right now. Honestly, yeah. so it, it would be it would be a lot. There's a lot of shit out right now. Yeah. Although, although, weren't we just talking about June the other day? June is going to be stupid too. Exactly. Isn't June? June July, isn't, June, is it, yeah, July, June. There's like five things coming out in June too. I think. So I'm I, might lose my, I might lose my job in June. Yeah. Fair. Same season. Okay. Euphoria season three. Yeah, been delayed indefinitely. At no, boo! We hate this. No, hate this. I haven't even seen the first two seasons, and I'm upset. <laughs> yeah, me neither. God damn it, Sydney Sweeney's. <laughs> I know this one's off, Abel. Uh, uh, God, it's it. the show of a generation. <laughs> show of a generation. <laughs> oh my God! Okay. Oh shit! Uh, uh, the character from Werewolf by Night will appear in the second season of Moon Knight. The second Aaron. season will have more than six episodes. Wait, the character. I'm sorry. Repeat the first the part. The character. He's from the character. A character. A character. Car some some character. Oh, oh, just a from character. Werewolf, yeah. From Werewolf by Night, um, will be in Man. Moon Knight season two. Elsa Bloodstone has to be. Nah, no other character. No other character would make. Well, you think it would be. Who? Man, oh, werewolf. um, man thing. Man, no, werewolf. Werewolf? You think the were the actual? I don't know about yeah. that. Yeah. Hmm. There's a lot of issues with him and Moon Knight fighting. I would have figured Elsa because she's part of the Midnight Suns, isn't she? Yeah. But the thing is, so is so is oh, werewolf so is by so by is werewolf by night. Yeah. yeah. Fair. Hmm. It's a lot of it. Okay. Oh, wait, we got we got a couple of comments here. <laughs> I love if y'all run an Aaron one Aaron <laughs> in one. regards to the J. Now, I don't know question. about that. I don't know about that. It's not I even really, a question. I, it's not like I could run for long. You just need to. You just need to jog. <laughs> I can keep up a ginger jog for a little while, but I ain't. I ain't running. I ain't full sprinting away from fucking anybody. Yeah. Well, Richard, how have you never four, seen four black and a half minutes? Four to four and a half minutes. That's all I need. Uh, He's a yo, Torian. Damn, y'all gonna be ancient by that time. By the time that right. folks the domain. Don't, don't oh know. man, I'm gonna leave oh, my Torian. word in the script. <laughs> this is designed by Deuce. Welcome, why didn't have have uh have, have I think Saint he meant She Hulk. No, Saint She Hulk. Saint have Saint She Hulk get injured? He'll snap. Really? <laughs> <laughs> mm, yeah, yeah, and then you're missing out, Aaron. Euphoria is a good, uh, a damn I good actually, show. I I showed him probably the most important part of Euphoria. He understands yeah. now. Yeah, I get it. I have to, you know, <laughs> I, I gotta, I gotta. <laughs> Euphoria is a good show and a wild show. Right. Oh, I've seen. Yeah, <laughs> Aaron now understands how important Euphoria is, and he'll be watching that show at some point. Yeah, I'm gonna watch that at some point. All right, Matthew Vaughn wants his original cast for Kickass. The cast back for the sequel. All right. The whole of it, the whole cast, yes. the original cast. Yep. That the girl from that show has to be in her twenties now. Ooh. I would assume. Hit girl. Yeah, hit girl. She's got to be in her twenties now. Sure, she's probably. I would assume. And then, wouldn't wouldn't the wouldn't did the wait did the dad die in Kick Ass? No, the the in the first yeah. one. Um, what was it? Um, what was the his name died. though? What was Big Daddy? his name? Was funny. Hit. It was it Big Daddy. <laughs> yeah, but stop. I think it might have been. No, no, I think it, I'm, I'm not kidding. I actually think it's it was, it was, it was, it was, yeah, I remember it was, but he died, right? I thought he died. He did yeah. die. Yeah, he did. I was gonna say because he's gonna be ancient by the time this fucking shit comes out. If he's in there, Dude, but, he was great in there, though. Daddy uh, he was great. He was great. Okay, uh, more able great news for Abel. Sini Sweeney has been casted as large breasted cart girl in the upcoming Happy Gilmore sequel. I Honestly, if she was casted as anything else, I'd be appalled. But uh, if you really think about it, though, in, in all seriousness, that's kind of crazy. If that's really true, that's kind of crazy. That's also how she's casted in Dream Number Three that I have on a nightly basis. <laughs> 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 
Oh, shit. <laughs> I mean, just saying. <laughs> oh, God. The more, Sydney, the more Sydney Sweeney I can get, the better. <laughs> You're going to get cut. Okay, Spider Man 4 will be. Trying to. I don't think you understand. (laughs) Spider Man 4 will be reportedly begin filming this fall. By whom? Who's making the movie? Sony? Sony. I'm out. See you later. Not watching it. (laughs) I need to hear this is an MCU movie or I'm not watching it. Don't ruin Tom Holland. Uh, okay, so Marvel is reportedly interested in making the Agents of Atlas film. Wow. What? You you guys want to see Shang Chi again? Uh, Everyone seems really interested right now. <laughs> I go, I do. I don't even know what Agents of Atlas. <laughs> I don't even know what that is. It's it's a team up with him, Wong, and. Um, and a girl from the Eternals, a speedster from Eternals. And and Madison with a Y? <laughs> is no, she in no it? No, it's spelled M A T Y. All right. Um, the Fantastic Four is supposedly in a different universe. Of course. It has to be. Yeah. And, Two and, movies. And, and that's the reason why I think that the X Men are not in the same uh, universe. So this is why we are. This is why you got an old Reed Richards. This is why you got an older scene of all the Fantastic Four. So they're testing all this stuff out. So that's why I think you're not going to get Galactus. I'm just I'm sorry. wondering. Do you I'm have any like other Fantastic gonna... Four news? Uh, probably. Wait, what were you gonna say, Abel? Uh, I'm just wondering if like they're all gonna get sent to the void. And then, like, the Void and Earth are just going to become one thing, and this is how all these characters become a part of. Probably. Like, at, like they'll do, like, a Battle World situation, and then everything will go back to just one universe. That's why I think this whole this whole multiversal saga, like, I was so in it first, and now I'm kind of, like, just out here confused and trying to figure out what the fuck's going on. And, you know, I, I get that it's ultimately going to lead to Secret Wars, right? Because that's the yeah. whole fucking thing. But, like, I think right now I'm having trouble with the buildup. How do we get there? You know what right. I mean? There's a lot it's, of missing parts that have to be connected to get to fucking Battle World. It's hard because like be I feel like I feel like the Infinity Saga, we had a lot more answers and it was actually a little bit more simple. Like yeah. there are stones, there's a Thanos, there's a gauntlet, they're gonna get the stones. Like that, like it was just like step, step, step. Like here it's just like step this way, and then we're gonna step this way, and then we're gonna kinda we're gonna go this way. Like there's yeah. just too many like twists and turns. And like it's getting everyone confused. Like a general audience needs to be able to follow a ladder, not a, you know, whatever the fuck. Yeah, decahedron. Um, that. <laughs> don't even know what it is. Never heard yeah, of her. They, they, they listen. They, they have painted themselves into this weird corner, and it's like, okay, how, how the hell do we get out of here? Um, too, too many stories that are supposed to be on a, a specific timeline that are, are not meeting. And now you got to do weird shit to get them to connect. You got to make all these weird specials that are supposed to be canon. And then they get rid of that project and they get rid of that writer and they get rid of that producer. And now the new producer wants to go his own path. And this, you know, it's it's like Loki. It's 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 like the Loki series, honestly. You know, you know what it I is. you know what the more I think about is like if we get the secret wars, well, if when we get the secret wars, because we will get there, right? Um, is there going to be enough screen time for everybody? Like, I genuinely don't know. I really like Iron Man, <clears throat> Captain America coming back, fucking uh, uh, um, Hugh Jackman. You know, he wants to be with Toby. Like, are we going to have enough screen time for all these fucking characters? Like, it's Absolutely it's a not. lot. It's no. a big fucking movie, man. And I don't know unless you make this bitch four hours how everybody gets screen time. I really don't. They can't move. They can't Yeah, exactly. So it's just probably going to be a parts one and two. You got to remember, it was about six books, seven books. There's still not going to be enough time. This 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 movie would have to be a four part before you remotely get to give all of these major actors yep. and major characters enough screen time, so that you know you could say that you've seen them. Like, I expect a lot of people to show up and be gone. Just mm-hmm. expect that. You know what I mean? Like I, yeah, this, this is sure. 
the nature of the story, unfortunately, is that some people are supposed to show up, they serve a purpose, and then they're supposed to be gone. Like, yeah. yeah so and, and listen, think about think about, so think about the like, actual the Infinity Gauntlet and Infinity War in comics, right? Like, how many movies should that really have been if they actually did like the real story? Oh, it could you know, have been so the, a lot more. Right, yeah. right. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. they're gonna they're gonna get you're gonna get our their abbreviated version within two movies of that, based off the way they want to tell it, and yeah. hopefully everyone gets their time to shine that we want to shine. We'll see. So you gotta realize know. it was three big movies that ended up to Endgame. So I think I don't expect nothing less than three or four movies. You're gonna yeah. get one. You're gonna get one movie and a Disney special. Nah. <laughs> Disney special. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. In more great news, Captain Marvel and Monica, Monica Rambeau might might find their way back to the MCU faster than you guys think. I thought you said great oh. news. Hey, 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 that's look, great look, news look, for look. me. Bring the yams back. Bring Gotta the yams back. That's all, that's all we want. Back. Gotta get to the yams. That's all we want. Bring the yams back. Yeah, yeah, uh, the next Pirates of the Caribbean film is officially confirmed to be, re be a, re a reboot. Abort, abort, abort. Danger, Will Smith. Danger. Oh, Danger, Will Smith. The character Melina Vost. Vost nah, there's no way. Vostokov <laughs> will be killed in a <laughs> killed or very injured in Thunderbolts. Everyone should be killed in Thunderbolts. They're fighting the century. They should all die. <laughs> Every one of them should fucking die. None of them can fight him. They still need to. This plot point needs to be resolved to me, or I'm going to be really angry. Because, like, if I see, like, Yelena take down Century, we're all going to have a fucking issue. Just FYI. Like, I can't deal with that. There's no fucking way. If anybody could do it, it'd be Yelena. <laughs> yeah, it'd be Yelena. I mean, Yelena is my girl. Listen, man, love her. Oh, Yelena but... did a did a little teaser of. Oh, oh, she yeah, did a teaser. All right. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, she was looking good, boy. Although, she although, looking good. although I'm not, although I'm not gonna lie, her real accent we could do without that. Just give me the one from the show. I'm good. Kate Bishop. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> nah, man. I, I could hear Kate Bishop on repeat for the rest of my life, and I'm good. <laughs> Dude, if she doesn't come at me with that accent, I don't want it. <laughs> Get the fuck, man! Not cap. I'm calling nah, cap. Nah, not cap. I'm not calling cap. cap. I'm I got calling so cap. thrown off when I saw her with that with her real accent. I was like, nah, I ain't doing it for me. Nah. I'm stoked right nah. now just thinking about it. <laughs> mm. nah, you, just... need, you need to die. <laughs> I might. <laughs> <laughs> All right, just just the just the Lynn is being <laughs> is being eyed to direct Spider Man. Four, starring Tom Holland and Zendaya, and Lynn was the director of Fast and Furious Nine and Great. Star Trek Beyond. <laughs> We're getting the Fast and Furious director to direct the Spider-Man movie. I love that. I love this direction. I love this direction that we're heading. It's great. We're gonna get, we're gonna get the spider buggies. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. <sighs> All right, uh, job of the hut, popcorn bucket. Stop. I have a, I have a picture. Cut it out. Here you go. Lord have mercy. <laughs> Yo, we, we really got to talk to whoever's making these freaking games, bro. <laughs> got to have a conversation, bro. That's disgusting. Nah, listen. If you just put butter in that one, you got real issues. I'd go speak to someone. You know what I mean? Like, that's, that's a real, that's a genuine fucking problem. I just, just want to know who, who, hurt, who hurt the person that made this bucket. That's what I want to know. Jesus yeah, Christ. Right. Okay, uh, Top that's a Gun. bucket. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Top Gun Three story has been already been set, been already been written. Sorry. I into the danger zone. Don't do that again. Star what? Wars uh, Star Wars star Jake Lloyd in mental health facility after psychotic break. Who is that? Uh, Jake Lloyd. Who did he play? The young kid that. Uh, oh, that's the young kid that played Anakin, right? Anakin, yeah. Yeah, that's sad. But was he upset that people weren't excited for him? Don't do that. You give me money now. 
Can't wait to go to hell. <laughs> I'll, I'm first in line, brother. I'll See you there. there. <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm right there, man. I got your seat. Cold cold first, first, in, first in line, man. First in line. <laughs> okay, some more exciting news. Lindsay Lohan is reportedly in talks with Marvel Studios to play a vixen superhero in the MCU. No, thank you. Thank you. I, could, I, I actually... I, I quite understand that. <laughs> I understand that. We're all leaving. Yeah, we're all gone. We're done. No. All right, who's no. she playing? No. They just said a they vixen. Don't know. She's going to play no. a vixen. A vixen? Is yeah. she Mojo? <laughs> what the fuck? Mojo, what? Like that answer. Uh, like that Does everyone answer. in the chat know who Mojo is? Uh, I'd, no. I'd like to show you. Oh God. Oh, God. Mojo. All right. Uh, I mean, to be look- fair, it's a it's an exact like replica. <laughs> it's really You're it's stop. A, it's a, stop stop stop. It's not stop. It is. What did, what did, what did Lindsay Lohan do to you, bro? All right, all right. Listen, tell me this. Tell me this doesn't look like Lindsay Lohan, okay? Right, stop stop. Oh, don't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Lindsay Lohan's people are gonna find you, bro. They don't have much yeah, else to yeah. do these days. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, she's still, she's, yo, she she still lives on Long Island. Tell her to come find yeah, you. Yeah, she, she gonna pull up on you I in a fucking care. minute. Yo, come yo, L I E X sixty five. What up? Let's you fucking just, go. What? Bro, what you got you I, pull up. Uh, fucking right. hell. Um, he's notorious said that's just disrespectful. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh god! god. All right, what's hand do to you, bro? My my karma will come swift. Um, <laughs> and just won't it? Won't it just? Mm-hmm. All right, your uh, Yuri uh, Lonthal will voice Peter Parker in Spider Man: The Marvels rival- Rivals. Mm-hmm. Marvel oh, rivals. rivals! The new ga- that new game that came game? out. It's, uh, it's like a six v six type of thing. It looks like yep. um, what was Valorant. the game they were saying? It looked like uh, Overwatch. It's, it's or, Valorant. Um, Valorant is that what it it's, is? It's it's Valorant with Marvel characters. It's literally oh, Valorant it? with Marvel characters. Yes. Mm. Is we that have a good a tra- thing we, or a we, bad we, thing. We have a trailer reaction to do on it. Oh, oh I love that. Um, yeah, because it came out the other day and it's very popular. Um, is that a, is that a good thing or a bad thing? I don't know much about that game. I'm gonna be honest with you. So, so Valorant is not really my type of game because it's um, I don't, it, it's like this, it's like this new. I don't know. I like it could be a good thing, and I think it'll probably make money. But I just see it as another cash grab for Marvel. Like that's, mm. that's just the way I see the game going. You're gonna have to buy power ups. You're gonna have to get different character yeah. costumes, and you're gonna have like I'm like, and I'm just I'm tired of Marvel doing it at this point. Mobile games, fucking PlayStation games, like it's just you know it's the same shit, rinse and repeat over and over again. Yeah. So yeah, but it could be cool. I mean, the trailer looked cool, but we'll see. All right. Uh, the first human neuralink patient used the implant to pull a silivaz- sil- a civilization civilization six all nighter. Yo, that- <laughs> you might want to do that again. I just Silver- you know, Karma Corner got Silver- you jacked up. <laughs> no, something else got me jacked up. Oh, uh, to pull a civilization so six yeah. all nighter. So basically, the guy who got the neural link played a game, played the game for fucking all night, and actually was doing pretty good with it. And he's, uh, I think he was a quadriplegic. He can only move his neck. So what's this neural link? That's the Tesla thing that they're putting in everybody's head to help them move and with their eyes, and it tells the brain tells the computer chip what to do, and it does it. Hmm. And it tells the computer what to do, and it actually does it. Is this is this the did he what did what did he he played chess? What did he do? He played chess and he, he played, played chess and civilizations. Fucking why can't I say this word? Civilization? Yes. Is that the word we're looking for? Yeah, that one. <laughs> civilization. Okay, gotcha. Civilization six. <laughs> I love you, Leo. All right, we're here. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, yeah listen, let's I go. mean I mean like I can't play chess, so you know. <laughs> it is what it is. That's cool though. I mean like I don't know how to feel about uh about 
that whole hookup thing I, and the, you know I, I don't know it freaks me out but anyway. i mean i guess when you're in a situation like that what do you have to lose right i, I mean pretty much that's what i would assume as but. crazy as that sounds to even say like I mean, it's just it like works. it just like it's, it reminds me of like I, this is gonna sound like a fucked up thing to say but it reminds me of like fucking cyberpunk like you're just hooking people up to shit and then they're like mm-hmm. i don't know it just the whole thing like freaks me out but i i get like you said if i was in that situation i'd probably be like yeah fuck it you know what i mean what else i got to lose you know Get back to playing video games. Yeah, pretty uh, much. Uh, Marvel Studio is currently setting the stage for the Hulkling theater. theater Jesus Christ! Go ahead, you got the <laughs> theatrical de- de- debut. So we're gonna get the Hulkling in the supposedly. There's a rumor. It's gonna round up with uh, round out with the Thunderbolts, and um, what the fuck was the other movie? Uh, the, the other the show. The Thunderbolts and a special oh Thunderbolts and a special presentation to let them know when is it going to come out and how he, his backstory is going to be. Hulkling, huh? Yeah. Are they going to give Hulkling the same hairline as Scar? Or right, that's literally what I thought of. Because like, because like, I'm locked in. <laughs> I'm locked in. Locked in for two two balding Hulk characters sounds hold fucking on, great. Hold on. Let me help you. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Man, I just, I, I just, I don't know if it's, I, I don't know if it's the She Hulk of it all. I just don't. No, have it, no, it Mar- is. It's actually I, the like, She Hulk of it all. Like, it, like it, I just don't have faith in Marvel doing anything right with the Hulk right now. Like, it's so fucking weird. I, I don't, I don't know if I just don't fucking trust. Especially after I saw Scar for a minute on screen, and I was like, nope, <laughs> can't do it. I just nothing about it. Can't fucking do it. I don't know. So Hulkling, I can't get excited for that. All right, Hugh Jackman teases Channing Tatum Gambit in new social media post. Oh, oh so I actually, I, I do know his first line. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Hugh Jackman that would, be, that would be fucking hilarious if they did that. I would fucking cry in the theater if they did that shit. That's perfect. There's, that is perfect. Oh, so he's going to die. Great. We're, we're going to lose, we're gonna lose yeah, Channing Tatum Gambit. Great. Right. <laughs> what, you know what the shitty thing will be? He'll be a great gambit for ten minutes, ten and then minutes, yeah. and then he'll die. We'll never see him again. Also, who's not in this movie? <laughs> uh, all five of us. <laughs> yeah, I might be in it. I don't know. I'm not gonna well, lie. I'm working, on, I'm working on it though. We're making some calls. I heard they needed. Calls. I heard they needed a blob. I might be there. <laughs> no, that's Lindsay Lohan. You want me to see the picture again? <laughs> Wrong with you people. Really oh god uh national treasure 3 is still in development the fuck it is <laughs> why <laughs> i like those movies man those movies uh, are just... they're good movies what is he but gonna Nicholas, do? Nicholas cage is out of here man he's just yeah. nick why? cage man nick cage man why you guys have a problem with Nicolas cage i don't got a problem with Nicolas cage i have i have no problems with Nicolas cage can't wait to see him in secret wars as ghost rider can't wait oh man <laughs> I have, no, I have no issues with with. I have no issues. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I heard he's, I heard he's gonna bring his Renfield character to a play, play Dracula. Oh God, yeah, fucking Nick Cage, man. I don't know. I don't know. All right. Uh, the uh, the upcoming announcement for Marvel games. The first one is going to be coming out is uh, 1943: Rise of Hydra. Uh, the number two game is going to be Wolverine. Number three is Blade. Number four is Iron Man. Number five is Black Panther. The number six is The Rivals. Is the Iron Man game that VR joint? I don't know. I don't know. I mean, they've been talking about that game for how long? If that's they, what I'm. That's what I'm thinking. I think they'd be better off doing an Unreal Engine type joint like like that Matrix game. That's what I think they're gonna do for Iron Man. That, that 1943 game looks absolutely ridiculous, though. I, bro, I, I might be more excited about that than Wolverine. But no, that's no, not true. no, that's not true. That's not true. So not true. Fuck yeah, is wrong not true. With you? I, I, I have like, I have this weird, like, I really want Wolverine to be good, but I have this like. I don't yeah, know, man. Uh, no, I, yeah, I just, I don't think it's, I don't know if it's gonna live up to the hype I want it to. I, I, I want it to. I, I really, really do. But I just. I don't know, man. I don't know, and and that bl- uh, the blade game is going to be what it is. I don't know if it's going to be anything really spectacular. It'll probably be all right, but 
don't know. We'll see. Are they? Did they give release dates on? They didn't give release dates. Did they no. say if no? No, no fucking release date. Because I don't remember. I don't remember them saying when that 1943 game was going to come out. I think it's going to be next year. We'll though. get we'll get all these games before GTA 6, though. Don't worry. <laughs> no, the fuck we will. GTA 6 comes out next year, sir. I have a countdown. <laughs> allegedly, <laughs> a- allegedly. <laughs> I can't right. wait. Uh, real world news. Uh, Louis Vuitton and Timberlands. Do a fucking collaboration. That's just uh, weird, weird news. Like, where'd you get that one? This is what came up on the news. <laughs> hey, guess how much the timbo, the the Louis Vuitton Timbos cost? Uh forty five hundred dollars. Nope. Next forty five thousand dollars. You're in the right, You're in the right direction. direction. Yeah, I know. Keep going. Keep going. Eighty five thousand uh, dollars. Lower. Sixty three thousand dollars. Seventy five thousand dollars. Yeah, I was closest. Good. I'm the winner. Yay! $75,000 for a pair of Tim's. I don't, know what, I don't know what fashion is anymore. Look. I'll be honest with you. B- fashion. Facts. <laughs> Some bitches. Some bitches. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much what it is. It's how tight these pants are getting. Um, so, okay. Fa- don't talk about me fa- like that. <laughs> you wearing tight pants out here? Not right now. Not right now. Not, <laughs> the weather, the weather isn't warm yet. We the weather's not warm yet. Inseams. <laughs> the three inch inseams is crazy. I swear to God, if, I, if I see too much style, any one of you, I don't know you. That's All right, Fantastic, much. Fantastic Four will take place in an alternate universe. Yeah, we, we did that already. Did that already. Boo. Uh, Christopher Nolan calls Jake Gyllenhaal personally to say that he lost the Batman role. Um, to Reacher. I'm okay with that. They didn't announce you... who Batman's going to be yet, right? No, but this is for the first Batman, the Batman the movie. Jake Gyllenhaal was up, it was up in the talks for it instead of the other guy. Oh, the original one. Yes. Oh. Wait. He That's called him personally. Original. Yeah, he told him, uh, Nolan called him personally. He told him he didn't have it. Did fucking what's it called? Uh, didn't he? He lost that to. Um... That is a... Yeah. So the Batman. Yeah, the Batman. Yeah, yeah, the Batman. The Batman. Emo Batman. Emo Batman. Emo, Emo Batman. Yeah. Oh no! Uh, but that's this is wait wait this is what I thought too. I thought I was I thought it was Christian Bale. Didn't? Are we talking about the Nolan verse or? Yeah, because you said Nolan, so Nolan would be Christian Bale. That's what I was saying. Christopher Nolan called Jake Gyllenhaal personally to say that right. he lost a role. He lost but a did, role in the Batman. But so didn't Cr- Christopher oh, so Nolan did? Christopher did, Nolan did. Batman, did. The, Bat, Thank Bat, you. Batman, yeah. See, you're confusing me, Leo. You're it's fucking up and fucking me up. <laughs> it says the Batman, so I thought it was the first Batman, and it had it looks like the fucking old guy. He needs some it milk. Like, <laughs> <laughs> it looked like the new guy with all the fucking hair. That's the picture Leo, that Leo, you're killing me, man. You're killing me it, today. It's one of those nights. Absolutely it's killing me. So we got new, we got new, uh, a new, a pack of Newports a day, Batman over, <laughs> over Jake Gyllenhaal, Batman. Oh cool. man, yes. <laughs> All right, uh, Christian Stewart. Uh, Are you trying joined... to kill me? <laughs> yeah. Uh, Christian Stewart. Uh, Not joined... in Gotham. Sorry, my bad. Not in Gotham. Not in Gotham. <laughs> Rachel. <laughs> Sorry, my bad. <laughs> I told Rachel when she travels with me, just expect it out of nowhere. I'm just gonna like, <laughs> walk away from. Walk away I hope from she's here because I said that to her one day and she's fucking crying. I was like, it's gonna be me one day, just so you know. Oh man, Rachel. Please Sorry, do it in the, please do it in the airport at customs. In the airport. Oh my god. <laughs> and, right and at people, customs. And, and people, now you know how this podcast was born. <laughs> this is, you know, the normal. I can't, I can't breathe. All right. Uh, <laughs> let's see. The last bit of news that I have. Okay, so we've covered that. Oh, Christian Stewart says joining the MCU sounds like a fucking nightmare unless Greta Grin, Grinwig. Grinwald, whatever the fuck her name is, directors directs it. Shut up, Twilight. <laughs> <laughs> that was perfect. 
<laughs> Shut up, Twilight. This is great. Uh, For real, though. <laughs> Shut your bitch ass up. <laughs> Where is it? I can't even get to the sound. Oh, up. God. Oh, and God. also, the last bit of news, we <laughs> also have... Uh... What a girl. Three weeks, whatever. Leo, you, you haven't you haven't gotten a name right since the comic corner tonight. I swear to God, I've been off the road ever since. Oh God, I, I won one today. I so, can't breathe. Uh, the last bit of news is Henry Cavill is going to be a trench coat wearing Wolverine in Deadpool three. Trench coat wearing which, Wolverine. Which Wolverine wears a trench coat? None of them. Except for, Wolverine? Except, except for old man Logan. Oh, so he's playing old man Logan? Or old uh Deadpool, uh Wolverine Deadpool. Uh uh Scarred Land. Oh. Hmm. You have them in that. Um that's the only time I've really seen them in a cover with him and Deadpool on it. Uh, is Wolverine, the, yeah, Scarland, uh, the death of Wolverine. That'll be a waste. <sighs> yeah, if they do, if they do the death of Wolverine, that's a waste. If they do, uh, Wolverine versus uh, Wolverine Deadpool team up, that's it's a waste. The waste would be putting Henry Cavill in any kind of bit role in that movie. <laughs> yeah, but it's happening already. It's uh, definitely yeah. happening. It's definitely it's... happening already. I just hope it's that's not the thing he signed up for, and it's. A different role suck. in the MCU. If that was the only thing he got, it would suck. But because, I could no, see maybe it. he's doing they're his teasing, buddy Ryan. Maybe exactly because they're teasing him up. That's all it is. It's a teaser. Mm-hmm. Maybe <laughs> Dorian said, "Wait, so no James Gunn news this week? Is the sky falling? We could talk about James Gunn if you yeah, want. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, uh, I no, doing. there was actually no James Gunn news this week. He do nothing foolish. Wow, James Gunn was quiet for an entire week before this podcast. It's incredible." He must be he must be working on Superman legacy. <laughs> Super, Superman, my bad. Hardcore. Oh yeah, Superman. <laughs> Superman, my bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They changed that. <laughs> uh no, no James Gunn news. Fantastic. No James Gunn news this week. You guys heard it here first. <laughs> you heard it here first. <laughs> Oh, wait, I got some more great news. Finn Jones teases his return as Iron Fist to the MCU. Now I'm now I'm really leaving. He better not. I swear he better not. I will be so angry at Marvel for doing that. Nice. Oh, uh, you know what the teaser was? He has in his hotel room the Power Man and Iron Fist issue number one. Oh, I feel so bad for him. Iron Fisting number one? <laughs> <laughs> wrong with you <laughs> so lot. many things yeah. so many things a lot thank you for noticing yeah <laughs> oh, man. Uh, yeah so uh <laughs> please say this is an early april fool <laughs> yeah. not yeah, finn that's... jones like anybody but finn jones come on man that's fucking terrible yeah we're getting finn jones back supposedly I don't, I don't believe it i don't believe it they said they already said they're gonna do female Iron Fist in Shang Chung Chi. Nah, I doubt it. Yeah, you don't think so? I don't know. We'll see. Uh, unless they go, they can't go all the way to the beginning because of Shang Chi is, is age is long is age alone. Mm-hmm. So I highly doubt that they're gonna go and bring back the female Iron Fist because the female Iron Fist will whoop Shang Chi's ass even with the ten rings. Well, weren't they talking about Fair. um like time traveling to like in the past? Like in, uh, like Egypt times, some crap like that. Like to... they, they were trying to. They, 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 the thing is, is with the whole thing that's tying in the Secret Wars is this Fantastic Four movie. You could take Wolverine and Deadpool out of it. The Fantastic Four movie is tying everything is everything that's going to lead up to. Uh, it's going to lead up to Secret Wars, and also it's going to tie in, and it's also going to break. In, also, they are going to do Midnight Suns. So it's going to be like that's going to be their next phases of the MCU. You can see it with just coming with Wonder Man, coming with Fantastic Four. The uh, Wolverine and Deadpool movie is just a money maker for this year, so that way yeah. people can get excited. Okay, Marvel is back with this Wolverine and Deadpool movie, and then they're going to hit you with the Fantastic Four. It's going to be uh, an earlier iteration of it. A lot of these young kids are not going to fucking like it because they don't read no books. Good, go away. 
don't they don't they don't know the content, so they're gonna rag on it, and then they're gonna hit you with more shit with uh, Doctor Strange, and then it's gonna lead up to the Avengers, Secret Wars, and all that, so on and so forth. Right, Spider Man Four, it's gonna be somewhere, all that shit. You know, you know they're not sticking to any particular story, my friend. Nah, you don't think they you don't think they give um they give Tom the black suit Spider Man before Secret Wars because they already no. left a piece of venom in I the MCU. I think he gets not he gets he gets not the before. suit dur- no he gets it during because I think during the comics, he got it during yeah the, that's what that big during, that big comic book um what was it what, what was the episode or what was the five. comic book number five yeah. Secret, that's yeah, that's him five. getting the suit in five the episode, or, yeah. Oh, no. five or seven. He, One of the two. I, I don't know. They'll 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 tease it. They'll tease it in like an after credit, and then like he'll get it during Secret Wars. I thought it was Secret Wars. It's Secret War, Secret Wars number eight. Yeah, that's eight, the eight. that's the, the, the cover, new suit. The, oh, <laughs> yeah, 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 that. Yeah, the hold suit. on. All he had to do was look right. I was gonna say yeah, yeah, it turn look right. on, <laughs> it's on the wall. We already, we already oh, yeah, said it was eight, bro. Yeah, it's eight. You're right. I thought you. I thought you sold that. Mind your business. Uh, I... <laughs> My fault. A firm is a motherfucker. Okay. I, I didn't. I didn't. Oh. Well. <laughs> talk about excuse me. me. Excuse Aaron, me. tell us. Aaron, now our next segment. Aaron, tell us about a firm. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. We don't talk about, about that. that. We're not trusted by them yet. So yeah. I don't know, <laughs> I don't know who they are. <laughs> I don't, know, I don't know who that uh, is. All right, so let's get into the main news, the piece of resistance. Word. X- what do you want to talk about? X-Men 97. Yeah. You want to talk about X-Men 97? By the way, uh, I wasn't here for last week's um, first two episode reactions. Uh, <coughs> yeah. Amazing, by the way. Yeah. And also, if you skip the intro at all during this entire series, you're a freaking loser. That's all I got to say. I'm just going to start there. Polar said he skips the intro. Yeah. Loser, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. Uh, also, guys, if you guys are watching, tell a friend to tell a friend to become a hothead. There's going to be a lot of nice things coming out for the hotheads. Yep, yeah, that's what I heard. Nice things. It's nice so things. Good, good things nice. are happening for the, the good things, things are gonna are be nice. happening. It's gonna be happening for the hotheads. Is- so- oh, my bad. I have allergies. My fault. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> if you're not already a hothead, I, I would suggest that you do so. I, I, it's a, it's only you, a guys are already, you guys are already getting snippets of the t- of the content that we're giving out to the hotheads, so yeah, it's going yeah. to be a, it's going to be a lot, and it's going to be coming pause fast. Nah. <laughs> mm. No, did he? No, but anyway, yeah. no, I, was, I, was, I was I was waiting for it, but I was going to no, let you finish what no, you're doing. Did he? Shout out, to, shout out to Cam. Shout out to Cam and Mace, man. That's that no Diddy's popping right now. Yo, mm. The fact that it came from Mace was like, Yo, I was like of all people, I was like, Mace, Yo, Jesus, I, man. I ain't gonna hold you. He's been, he been killing Diddy. Uh, oh man. Do you he know how long he's been? Do you know how long he's probably been holding on to this? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, for he, sure. He's wide sure. right now, bro. Are you kidding me? Yep. All right, I'm so assuming, I'm assuming she just heard that. The Batman impression. <laughs> uh, anyway, sorry, X Men ninety seven. My bad. I get distracted. Yes. All right, who wants to start it off? All right, clone clone Jean Gray, Madeline Pryor. What do we yeah. think? Yeah, clone Jean Gray. Um, yeah. So obviously, Leo almost gave it all away last week, and we told him to stop. He was about to just go on into this next episode. Son of a. I mean, bitch. it's just you, <laughs> if you if you if you gotta let it, it happen, you. man. You guys want to know the next episode? No, 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 no. no just, let, just, let, just let me enjoy my Wednesdays, man. You know what I mean? Just, I'm good. Just let me, I'm, I, you know, I'm feeling good about where we're at. Um, I really enjoyed the episode. And, and, and it's totally, like, I, I love the, um, I don't know. I, I just love where the story is going. I have an idea of where the story is going to Leo's point. Cause I have some idea of the comics a little bit. I haven't read the whole thing. But um, it's definitely going to be. I, I love the way it's been written so far, which makes me think that whole firing thing. I'm like, hopefully they don't fuck it up since he's not the one doing season three and whatever they do moving forward. Um, but can I just say something? I'm going to say something, and then we're going to get into like more of the details. The more I watch, and maybe I'm nitpicking. So if anybody's going to blast me in the comments, feel free to do so. The Magneto costume is really pissing me off. I don't like it. You don't like the big I, M? I don't no, I don't. I want. Not- 
I don't mind no. the M. I I hate no. the sleeves. I don't the like the Magneto, throw me off. Magneto the cut, outfit. The cut off on the sleeves. They really just make me weird. Like look, like look at Madeline. Madeline Pryor. Like you know how Madeline Pryor has the cut off on the legs thing. Like that's nice. Magneto cut off sleeves. Eh, weird. No Diddy, Com but like weird. Wait, is, is, no, that costume's comic accurate. He wore yes. that in the. Yes. Yeah, he no, wore he wore the, that. That's, yeah, I don't. I, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't remember that that's costume. There's being in the um comics. the comic uh the co I mm. forgot what comic it is when he's uh the cover is him in during the trial handcuffed like in that suit like that's huh. uh, yeah. This is yeah. this is the one thing. Okay. This is the one thing that I am loving about this series. Mm. This is gonna bring very up accurate. Up it's coming. Uh, yeah, it, it, yeah. The accuracy of this series, it's hitting. It's hitting on a lot of things, but it's it, it is also missing a couple things, but. Where it's hitting, it's supposed it, it tells you enough of the story that you know you can follow along. So for the it's it's fitting right in the certain it's fitting right in the pocket where it's supposed to be. Oh shit! He did wear this in the comics. I just looked it up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't believe us? Yeah, that no, was no. Thing. I no, I believe you. I just I just didn't know. Yeah, so I'm so it, used to, I'm so used to the conventional fucking the cape and the you know like I like you know, the, I don't know I don't know I just I like that I like I like that costume better. The OG one on, from, from on the original. Yeah, my bad. Anyways, anyway, continue. Yeah, so we got, we have the whole, she's coming back, uh, Jean's coming back, and now we have the whole story of Mr. Sinister, the guy I've been asking for for the, the longest fucking time. <laughs> That's the guy. That's the That's guy. The guy. Can, I, can I actually say something about Mr. Sinister? Yes. I there were times like where where like you're looking at his animation i feel like a lot of his character like was animated too dark in certain places like i feel like mm -hmm. in the original series like he looked a lot bigger yes. and like yes, menacing right. and like you're you actually, know what i mean like right. like right. fuller right. like yep, that's the right. only that was right. the only like thing i didn't like about him but i thought listen the voice was on point yeah he, you know the way when he got blasted in the chest like that was very <laughs> like awesome and accurate um but like and when he would the fade teeth back were into accurate. the dark, the he was teeth, creepy as hell. Dude, yeah. the way he'd fade back into the shadows, like the original series, awesome. But like there, like that was the only thing. I'm like, I feel like he looked a little bit more menacing they, in the 90s show. They they almost made him, like you said, like less menacing and more like horror. Yeah. Like yeah. he was more like spooky than he was like actually physically everything, a presence. Which... Everything looked better in the older. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Version. I have a question for you guys. When you guys yeah. when you guys saw Morph going into the shower, you thought this shit was gonna go left, didn't you? I no, sure no, did. No, no, no. I, no. I sure did. <laughs> no, I was no, like, no, 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 I didn't. No, I didn't. I thought it was gonna go left, right, and center. <laughs> no diddy, okay, no diddy. I thought it was going left, right, and center. Yo, wait. Let me tell you something about Morph. When Morph cracked that joke on Gambit, I almost Yo. lost it. Yo, he said, Yo, he said, he said, Yo, he said they're working on their stamina. I was no, like, not even that. No. You know I what the best like, part of that was? Nah. You know what the, no, let me tell you the best part of that was. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, 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 beep. It's the look. It's the look that he gives him while he's beep, doing beep, it. Like, yeah, it was yeah. Just like, was like, I was like, Bro. yo, Morph's an asshole. Shit, I, yo, man. That's I was literally up. just like, I was like, this is for adults. Big. That's exactly yeah, it I is. Like. Sure <laughs> is. He is quickly becoming like the X variable. He might take over yo, the season. He, he literally, he, might, he, he literally might, said, he, he literally said, oh season. look, they have it from from ten to twelve, from twelve to four, from four to like. I'm like, wow, they really have it for a long time. <laughs> he even looked, he looked <laughs> Was, yeah, my man, my man, my, 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 my boy Gambit's about to make an R&B album after this. Yo, <laughs> I don't know what the fuck else he's gonna do. I don't know what else he's gonna do. He's definitely depressed. He's on his, he's on his old Drake right now. If you saw him, he was like, "Oh, I'm gonna go find her." Uh -huh. and Morph was just laughing. Morph was like, he "Lay off, and we were yeah. just lay off, Morph." Bro, that shit had me rolling. Got it bad. Yeah, that. <laughs> Yo, but I thought Wolverine was about to get it in with Gene. Oh, oh, I know. Yeah, I know what you're yeah, talking. But, yeah, yeah, but, they, yeah. but they shared that moment, and long story short, here comes Scott's name out of her mouth. Yeah, yeah I, of I, I hate to tell Wolverine, but he in the friend folder, bro. That's that's dying. He that got friend zone worse than Kaisenat with Tyler yeah, the other bro. night. But, <laughs> <laughs> 
that was bad though. <laughs> that was fucking terrible. Oh, anyway, man. that was terrible. Yeah. He's, oh he's man. But um, an- another thing uh, this show is doing really well, in my opinion, I like how they're showing the powers. Like mm-hmm. I like Magneto's magnetism, like the way they did Gene. Like I thought, like like the blue, the way it was coming out looked cool. Like it's different. Well, I I didn't realize I actually had to go. The, the, you know what I love about the show? This is from my perspective. Like I don't I I don't consider myself an expert on the X Men by any means. So I actually had to go after the show was over, and I was like, "How strong is is Madeline?" Because I was like, she was right there with Magneto, like fucking him up, and I was like, "Oh, okay, like she's strong, like she's really fucking strong." She's a direct so I was like. Clone. Yeah, um, um, Gene, right, right. I'm looking this up. I'm like, I, I didn't know that she's a direct clone and had the powers. And like, I didn't realize that was the extent of her power level. I was like, oh, shit, that's fucking she's tough. This I was story, like, wow. This storyline is one of the one of the peaks of the X-Men, nine, uh, X-Men 90s uh, animated series. Mm. But it didn't get as much. Series? Yeah, the animated series, because it was a, it didn't get a lot of shine in the, in the animated series. It only got like a two parter. I think it was mm. a two or three parter in the animated series. That because we got the Savage Lands and then we got um, Sinister, but then you have Morph in this series. He started to remember Mr. Sinister, and when Mr. Sinister comes, starts coming in through the baby monitor, and breaks out her powers, that and you nutty. get to see, you get to mm. see the. He doesn't give a fuck. He just wants to make the perfect mutant and take over the right. fucking world. So that's why this storyline is based off of that. If I can't go any deeper because I. Start going into the next episode. <laughs> so I want to go. <laughs> that I like. I got a baby with a techno virus. Yeah, Yo. Yo, you already know where that's going. Yep. Yo, he looked. Cr- the baby oh. looked crazy after all that. Right. I was like, oh shit. Also, I will. I will tell you something that I didn't like. In the very beginning, where they did previously on X Men, it was Gene's voice. I didn't like it. You didn't yeah, like it. I. I didn't like it. That's fair. I didn't like that's it. That's fair. And I know I what like I, I didn't like. What they depicted. Exactly. Oh, was it a little too different? I, I don't. It, a, I don't... it felt a lot different to me. Yeah, might I'm, might be the same actor. I'm I don't know if it's sure. the same actor. I, I, yeah, sure. I'm not yeah, sure. He didn't sound know. like my, he didn't sound like Charles. Trust me. But like, mm. um, the horror elements in this episode like really stood out. Like when they were in, um, when they were in the house and they were going through the different rooms yes. and like all the crazy monsters were coming out. Like I, I, I know you guys love that shit, right? Like, yeah. uh-huh, of course, you're all about, you're all about the lights. Shit. They'll turn the lights off at that point. <laughs> you turn the lights on at that. We will turn the lights on for sure. Yeah, you know, but the weird scene of it is the beast scene. The beast, the, <laughs> the beast scene was weird. I, I was, was like, like, okay, so the monster just oh, he opens the door. There's a monster there, and he's like, hello there, and then he sits no, out his tongue. Like, I think, I think one of <laughs> us got the, the wrong floor. One of us got on the wrong floor. Dude, how about how about how about Gambit going into the room and seeing like like uh, Rogue and Magneto oh, like, be, the, like their skin yeah, going their into skin each other? Like, I'm like, Ugh. oh, I was like, no way. That was horrible. I mean, that's one way to do it. There are other ways to but do Madeline it. But Madeline is the, the the way this story is going to go, and the way it should go. It, it's you guys are in for a treat, and that's why this story is going to lead into the X Men live action Sinister story. They're gonna leave you I, I on. A, so. they're, gonna, they're gonna leave you on a very good cliffhanger. Oh yeah. Yeah. So. Dude, honestly, cool. if Mar if the MCU I mean, was smart, they would go right to Sinister Man. They need they need we need something I'm, here. I mean, like I'm, I'm, I'm down because we haven't seen it in live action yet. But my, my concern was seeing it twice in animation and in live action. I was like, is that going to be too much sinister? Dude, at that point? We, but I like, guess this is what th- we not, came that, for. Yeah, you're yeah. not definitely going to be seeing it twice. Yeah. If it's what Leo says, then it's a continuation of what we yeah, watch. That, that's different. I agree. Yeah. yeah, that's that's a different thing. I, I mean, I, then, I was thinking they were going to retell the same thing again, and then I'm like. I would why, although you know, I, I don't know. It, it also, all depends on what the MCU decides to do. But and also, if they, if that's what they're doing, now imagine Henry Cavill as Mister Sinister. He's introducing the new X Men, and then you get that major fight. I don't. I don't know if I can. I just can't see him as Sinister. I don't know what it is, but I just. Yeah, I can't. He, he, I get he, it. I get where you're coming from, but. I he already has the hair, dude. Yeah, I can see I, him doing it. Yeah, you think so? Doing it, doing it. Hmm. Interesting. I can see. I can see the That's power what, level alone. He's he will be good for. I mean, look, and then, and it's a full face. So yep. His face. It is. He's just blue. Yeah. I guess. 
and um, you, they, you'll realize how evil Mr. Sinister is. This motherfucker dunked a baby inside of a tube of fucking and gave him a techno virus. Gave, gave her a, gave him a virus. A baby. <laughs> you be the vulnerable boy. To be honest, I'm, 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 honestly, in, in this in this day and age, I'm surprised they even did it. Like just to, you know what I mean? Like I'm surprised mm -hmm. they even showed you that. Like let's throw this baby in a freaking tube and let's hey, let's experiment on that baby. Listen, mm -hmm. if, if the I'm Flash, so glad they did it. If the Flash can put a baby in a microwave, <laughs> I, think, I think I think a tube of water would be all right. True. Yeah, um, uh, what yeah. else? We also got Morph turned into uh, I think Spiral. Huh? The chick from the chick from Mojo World. What was That's her name? Spiral. 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 Yep. Spiral. Sorry. Oh, trust me, I was okay. waiting for that. <laughs> yep, the, the chick from Lindsay Lohan world. She was stop yeah, it. She was stop, stop, stop. What happened? I didn't say stop. anything. What happened? Cut it out, man. <laughs> and, then, and then we could get and then we get At the end. Yeah. So if you don't know, I don't think Do they're gonna know? touch if you guys don't know, Gene and Scott's oh Madeline and Scott's mm -hmm. son, son is is Cable. Yep. Yeah, Cable. If you guys haven't figured that out yet. Yeah. Cable. Mm -hmm. I was looking at that baby. That virus is right up on top of that. Yeah, that virus is exactly <laughs> where it needs to be. I was gonna say right where it needed to be, huh? <laughs> you got it right. There we go. Yeah, and then, they did. They then did. we lose. Then we uh, we lose Bishop. He goes right. back into his own time. Yep. And then but they they kind of they kind of they kind of over. I can't, it. I can't go ahead with them because I'm gonna fucking say yeah, something yeah. I am not supposed no, to say. No, say it. No, I'm not gonna say it because I'm gonna fuck it up. <laughs> I, I <laughs> thought they I thought that they like kind of like went over the whole bishop being here thing. Like they didn't touch no. on it enough. They stayed mentioned it and then it just kind of got dropped. Like it was like I want more I was like, I want more, expl yeah, I want more yeah, explanation they're, why they're he's gonna, here. We're gonna go with Bishop Bishop to the future at some point. Like oh, yeah, I'm assuming. I can't I'm not gonna remember I, I, I haven't watched it. It's been many, many years. Yeah. But, isn't he still here from the original series? Yeah, yeah, yep. he he right. he is. So, he is. I get that, but I feel like I feel like they mentioned it, and then like Beast cut him off and stopped him from explaining the whole reason why he's here in the fucking first place. I mean, right, because what, I was like, like I was like, go back and watch the old one. That, that's <laughs> exactly. You watch the old one. He gets. He gets. You you'll get the the thing is they picked up exactly almost exactly where yeah, the right, old one left off. off. Yeah. yeah. So if you watch, yeah, I think continue. the last three or four episodes, you'll get the bishop. Yeah. You get the bishop explanation in there. So that's why they didn't deep dive into it. So they're like, mm -hmm. okay. So like, when people like anybody who does hasn't seen the anim the animated series, they can say, oh, where the fuck did he come? Hey, go watch. This is the one gripe that I have with Marvel right now too. This is one thing that DC is doing better than them. They are. They no, this this is just true what? as a comic as a comic as a comic book head mm -hmm. as a <laughs> as a comic book head mm. they give you the issues that they're working on so they'll tell you oh, so I, I this is yeah, from yeah. this comic book this is from this comic book this is from this comic book mm. they need to do this with this new series because a lot of these kids nowadays haven't don't know about uncanny X Men. They need to do it in the recap. Like, like, like pre if we get to yeah. a Bishop episode, yeah, previously yeah. on S Men, here's how Bishop got here. Here's where we're going. Oh, just, yeah. oh, just, oh, but this will drive their sales, though. If you put yeah. the comic book in there and say, okay, this is the book that we're 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 working with. Mm -hmm. So this is the run that we're going to be working with. Boom. Because already all the X, oh, you can't find an uncanny X Men on the, in a fucking comic book shop right now. That's oh, no. under fifteen fucking dollars. No, of course no. you can. There's no shot. So it's like fifteen dollars. The lowest I've seen it is ten bucks for an uncanny X Men. Mm -hmm. So I would suggest anybody who's a comic book head wait until the end of the series and then try to see if the drop, the prices drop. But I, the way this series is going to go and the way how good it is being, is yeah. going and the storyline is going, Listen, it's see, not going to drop. Season two is already written. You know they're going to work yeah. on season three. This this show ain't going mm -hmm. anywhere because yeah. it's got too much traction. It's got yeah. it's, it's got a perfect fucking Rotten Tomato score. Yep. Also, are, are we not going to talk about Forge and Storm? Oh, that what? Ends. I can't get into. I can't go into that. Not, yeah, it's, so, it's, it's it's in the it end. It it's, it's yeah, in it the happened end. at the end. It did. It happened at the end. We can get into it a Dude, little bit. Uh, you you yeah. can't spoil Dude, anything, you know, but you can get into it. Okay, so where I'm going to go is why is for why why do we introduce Forge? Why do we introduce Forge? Why do we? I I don't know. Why do we introduce Forge? Where did Forge come from? Well, Forge actually said. 
I'm going to get you your powers back. He pretty much said he did did say it. He did say it. No, that's actually what he said. He's like, let me get you what you lost. But yeah, let me get you what you lost. But he's the one who created the gun to kill Magneto. Oh, (laughs) that's the part I didn't want to to tell you guys. No, that's fine. It it is what it is. It's like, and then the the next episode, you know what? I'm See, we'll, we'll no, that's fine. Stop. Week. No, listen. Stop. Stop I have, there. I'm right there, dude. Because if I say, if I go fine. forward, they're gonna know listen, this. Next listen. Episode. listen I mean, obviously, his, his, name, his, name, his name is Forge. He forged a weapon. Yes. Pretty straightforward. Yeah. Nothing crazy there. I just, I had a, I had two like other quick notes that I just wanted to mention that like caught my eye from the episode. So like, I love the fact that when they were doing all the flashback scenes of like Madeline slash Jean and Scott through the years. Yes. The, the faces yes. were all melted off, as if to say, like, <laughs> we don't know when they switched. Like, has it has it been Madeline this whole time, dating back to the beginning of X Men ninety, like the original series? Like, we don't know. And it was like, right. I thought that was really cool. Like, I was like, okay, so we really. And then at the end, they tied it all together by having Gene and Scott like stand away from each other and look at each other, like, I don't fucking know you. Like, what the fuck? I don't even know how long I've actually been with you or not. I have no idea if we're like a like a real thing. So maybe my boy, maybe, maybe Wolverine could swoop in. <laughs> but this is the whole thing with with that. I love the. That's a great point. And yeah. also, you got to see the first iteration of Cyclops, yeah, and the original team and everything else. Mm-hmm. You got you got all that in mm-hmm. the flashback. I love the like, flashbacks. Oh, I almost remembered, but Scott Scott is he still get they still giving him a little bit of a bitch vibe because he fucked up his own room. He did. I mean, it's gonna happen. It's gonna you happen. know what I mean? Yeah. It's gonna. Happen. No, he you've been, you, 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 you had a gene. You've been clapping yeah. cheeks for all this time. <laughs> I mean, shooting up the club. You, you listen, shooting up the club. Listen, you, 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 get, you got a baby out of a shit. You let him be pissed. Hit it. <laughs> hey, listen, he somebody he showed you. Let him. Listen, he had he had a gene. He didn't have the gene. Yeah. Fair. Show DG. And what, uh, what another G was doing, like, hey, let me tell you something. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, 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 no. Thousand came up. <laughs> um, I, I also, I also uh, noted down here that two episodes now. So obviously, episode one, we had um, Gambit hop on Wolverine for the power up, and yeah. then in this one, we got Cyclops charging up Bishop. Yeah, to get, and I was like. That shit was fucking. I was like, no, that's cool. fucking cool. I'm not gonna lie to you. I mean, pretty cool. Dope, but I mean, that's just that's like that's what he does. Like, yeah, so, like, yeah. That's, it's just the that's... way the way they're presenting an enemy yeah, yeah. the powers. I really like. Yeah, I, I like that they're used. They're, they're like it's actually like a team. A team. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. we work together, and you know th- this is the shit we train for. Although Rogue and Magneto are getting a little excessive with the training, but besides, besides <laughs> that, twelve that power, hours in a yeah, row, bro, man. Oh, that power up's gonna go crazy when we see it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. Yo, but Magneto's oh, a G, God. though. You gotta realize I, Magneto's listen, a G. I wouldn't want Yo, Magneto, Magneto clapping my girl's cheeks. I don't <laughs> I know about all that. I don't know about yeah, all that, Magneto's fam. A, Magneto got some kids out here. If, if I was Gambit, I would, I would, you know, yeah, time to challenge him to a duel and, and hold this L. Well, you know what I mean? Got to hold this. <laughs> Gambit will get his ass whooped with this back, you know? I know, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> He will, he know. will fuck up everybody's yeah. favorite character. <laughs> yeah. yeah, don't, you know, I just, I need, I need my Gambit to not be depressed. I love that guy. You know what I mean? Yeah, <laughs> I like the, he's, he's depressed right now and it's not, I like, I like confident Gambit. I need that guy back. You know what I mean? Like right now he's. He's sulking. He, you know, he's sulking. Wait, he's looking like uh, Wolverine right now? Yeah. He's, 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 he's holding the picture. He's holding the picture. <laughs> he's, we, like, oh. listen. he's like, oh, my sugar. We, we, know, we, know what the, we know what's going on in the training room. <laughs> yeah. You already know. Yeah, it's getting magnetic in there, if you know what I mean. Mm, oh, <laughs> uh, shit. But you also see, like, where we were talking about Madeline's powers, it's she's on the next level, dude. Yeah, she's. she's I didn't realize how strong she was, bro. She's fucking strong. I, I don't. I didn't know all that. And the way, so. though, the, the G part about it, the way she cut off, she was like, yeah. "I'm gonna live my own life. Mm. I've been living everybody else's life. Fuck yeah, they, that. <laughs> I'm out. Yeah, I don't give yeah. a fuck about Scott. I lost my baby. She fuck, had a I'm baby gone. Out for herself and everything. She was like, "Yep, Madeline Pryor. That's what you call me." Mm-hmm. So I'm like, Down. shit. I'm assuming she'll probably be back 
at some point, right? Like they probably won't get rid of her through the whole like maybe for a while, but we might not see yeah. her this season. Will she be back, Leo? I don't not this season. I was gonna say Next not season. this season. I'm assuming in another season. Or Next, two. Uh, if they do it is she'll be back three. Probably season three. Because she is a part of the X Men. Yeah, I was gonna say they left it off on a like she could come back. Like Jean was like, Oh, stay, this is your family too. Like she's gonna come back. It's obvious. They he made it is, obvious. Is he, but this is what Scott fucked up. This is why he's a fucking little bitch to me. Why? Because he, he could be he could be clapping devil <laughs> chicks now. <laughs> with, with Delphi, you, you my brother. <laughs> Who's that? We're here. <laughs> We're here. <laughs> We could have been played this cool as shit. Oh. It would have had both. Oh. Well, honestly, the the <laughs> scene that told me with uh with Cyclops when he was like, <laughs> "I'm not, I'm not gonna abandon my Yo, son." Oh my god! The room and then walks out the room <laughs> like I'm not gonna be a part of this. I'm not like, gonna be a part of this. <laughs> you just I'm like not gonna daddy. abandon my son, but your son is gonna die if you don't fucking send him. You just like your daddy, bro. And then, yeah, and then yeah, you man. have, and then you have, he just walks out, messes up his room. I would have been talking both of them up and like, hey, you know, girl, you, 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 you. <laughs> hey, it's good to have you back. It's good to have you back. Uh, you know, <laughs> I, you saw the size of the bed; it's big enough. I don't, so, I don't know. I don't know if Cyclops got it like that, man. I don't know. See, that's why he's that's why he's a bitch. <laughs> He ain't got enough riz. I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know. There's only so much laser. <laughs> <laughs> man, go shoot that, shoot that laser early. <laughs> I don't know, man. He's been shooting that laser a lot this season. In all different types of ways. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, shit. Yo, but he did look shook when he shot Sinister, though. I'm going to shoot this laser long Yo. style. <laughs> I didn't. Please. I didn't realize. Wait, I didn't realize that Sinister could actually be affected by his no, laser. That's, like that. that's, the, that's the thing that like like gets him the most. Like yeah, because they they showed one of these things did like a flame, and they were like, oh, Sinister actually gets like surprised that Cyclops beam can fuck him up, well, and they why, did it in earlier seasons. I didn't realize. To, that's why he wants to make the baby. Yeah, yeah. Because he wants to. He wants their DNA. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Boy, Very cool. Very cool. That's, that's the way he Mm-hmm. You, guys so, have, you, you guys have so i we, we don't have to answer this now but i have so many questions because like i think it's a lack of knowledge on my part like i i don't know how you get two mutants as powerful as gene gray slash madeline and cyclops and you end up with cable not that cable's bad but like also the version of cable that i'm used to doesn't really maybe fully extend like the What's powers the, that, that you're used to? the one from the fucking movies i don't know the one oh. from the comic books oh <laughs> you need to go get you need to go get yeah. you just get you a copy of new mutants that's what i'm saying so like from yeah, my yeah. perspective and, uh, i don't know the comic book cable which i'm assuming is way more <laughs> badass than the, the one we've seen in dead body yeah, like, yeah, yeah, slide let's yeah, yeah, go like, <laughs> like, I, need, I need to do my homework on that cable because i'm assuming cable from the comics is fucking crazy because he probably has some crazy powers that we haven't seen in movies yet. Oh, they, they nerfed so, him in the movie. Yeah. They nerfed him like a. Because in Deadpool, he just looks like a crazy old man with a fucking gun. Like, no. and you're like, okay, I'm like, all right, cool. And he was cool. Don't get into it. Like, he was cool in Deadpool, but I'm like, that's obviously not the real power that Cable has because he's got their DNA. So he's got to have some cool fucking shit going on. But we could delve into that off stream if you want but like i gotta i gotta read some comics on the real power that cable has because i don't know i'm assuming we're gonna see it in the animated series so or to an extent yeah you're not you're not (laughs) if they do it right you're not gonna see it this season you're not you're not gonna hear no no you're not you're not gonna hear from cable or bishop this season i think yeah probably not but but bishop probably come back at the end though Mm, uh, you don't think so he might come back for something i don't know it was such it was such an entanglement for him in the first Iteration of the uh, show mm. yeah. came back. Like how many times you show up in, in the first one? Uh, came back to to stop. He came like back he to there. stop the. He came back to stop the the stop the, gambit. Stop days gambit. of future past. Past days, days of future, future past. past, and then he came apocalypse? back to apocalypse series. Yes. Yeah. Mm. But well, it 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 doesn't go well for him in the apocalypse. He, series. he was back almost once a season though, just about right. Mm. Was I it enjoyed- almost? Not the first, not, not, not once a season, not once a season, but he was yeah. back at least. I gotta freaking re. I I've watched half of the season, I've half of the animated series again, but I'm, I'm my mind is so hazy. Uh, probably like maybe four times. 
maybe okay. like tops in the in the animated series. But I figured because we're not. Gonna... Remember that's an apocalypse series too. When he comes back, I figured we're probably not going to see Cable definitely. until next season. Maybe another season, like yeah. maybe season three. Like, that's I'm know. thinking that you won't see think, Bishop yeah. maybe to the end or the next season. Because uh, by the way, oh go, go ahead. ahead, sorry, no, go no, go ahead. I was just gonna say, what up, Fatal J? Welcome oh, on Fatal in. Jay, what up, bro? Fatal, what up, bro? And then, uh, sorry, hey, it's it's Kiki. Uh, this episode was great. They really turned up the animation. Yeah, I, yeah. I agree. It was it was it was dope. The fight scene dope. in the church, or wherever they were, was really cool. That yep. church looking scene. Yeah, they did. The, the animation is. I was I was so worried going into it that I wasn't gonna like the animation. It's growing on me the more I watch it. So. Mm-hmm. You know, I, I'm because cool. the, the story is so good. That the story is good, it looks, and it's, it and is, it's the, and it's the goddamn X Men. You know what I mean? That's what, like, dude, we want story. We want story. X-Men. We want X Men. Yes. The yeah, X-Men. and the thing with Storm too, it's it's how they it, it, it they're speeding it up. Yeah. Because yeah. Storm Storm lost her powers and she lost it for four years. Oh so it's, damn! Yeah. So, yeah. It, so she doesn't meet For Forge until four years later, mm-hmm. and they mm-hmm. didn't specify that when she met him because she just met him right off the bus in the diner or at the bar drinking a beer so in texas by the way in texas <laughs> right yeah they were in fucking texas. you were deep in the heart of texas deep in the, <laughs> in the heart, heart of texas. texas i actually know where that bar is you know <laughs> <laughs> i frequent that bar <laughs> it's terrible but yeah but it's it, it's the way they're doing it they're they're taking out they, they're taking a lot of the muscle and the 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 they're taking a lot of good parts of the story without yeah. leaving you okay. What's this the suspense and what is this? But when she gets her powers back, mm. oh, yep, I can't wait to see that shit. If she get, <laughs> if they do. If they're not gonna do it this. If, the way they're rushing it, I don't know what they're gonna do with her in the season. But I, I can't shit. tell you. I can't tell you <laughs> the, the depression I felt from. Omega level threat detected to losing the powers. Dude, like, no son, powers. Son of a bitch. Yeah, that hurt. <laughs> I was so mad. I was I was so upset. I was like, you sons Yo, of bitches. They gave, they gave, her, storm. Some, they gave her some moments though. Jesus. Yeah. Yeah, Yo, when that sentinel said the omega it. level threat detected, I oh, lost. I was like, oh happy for her. <laughs> dude. But the thing is, is that they're redeeming the characters that they're supposed to redeem. Yeah. Of course. Finally. Finally, they're doing that right. Yep. But yep. once she lost the powers, I was like, wow, we're going to go through that? But we're going to go through the whole depressing scene of Madeline and her? No, we're not. What the fuck? Mm. We're not going through that? We're not going to get the famous cover of Madeline holding her ass like by the fucking throat? No, we're not getting that? <laughs> <laughs> we're not getting that comic book cover? Come on, man. Give it to me. Gotta, what the fuck? They, they, they have to fit it into the amount of episodes. I know. They, 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 but so, as a comic book head... That's one of my favorite covers mm. because Bro, Storm's Redemption comes after that. Like how many episodes do you want this to be, man? One hundred and twenty-five thousand. <laughs> never going to give you that. <laughs> have you seen? Have you seen One Piece? <laughs> take, what you, take what you got. Have you seen One Piece? That's why. I, that's why I'm like, okay, we're getting, we're getting good. But, but that's the one thing that I, like I said before, that's why DC. That's the one thing that I like about DC. They let you know, okay. These are the issues that we're working on. This is what will also drive up my sales in my comic book series. And this will also bring in new readers. Because that's the whole name of the game for Marvel and for Disney. So if I get new readers and I get these kids buying my X-Men 90s, my uncanny X-Men from back in the 90s, that are costing $15, I'm still making my money. Because mm-hmm. now people are, you would not believe the comic book world right now with the uncanny X-Men. Um, Everybody's yeah. doing their run sets. Everybody on the fucking internet is doing their run sets to complete that whole run set of Uncanny X Men. Yeah. Everybody. <laughs> Great. I was myself. a hype series. Which I'm missing <sighs> about sixty of them. So yeah. See, as though it's so <laughs> so adult. I wonder how deep into Forge and Storm are they going to go? I don't think. It's, I don't know if it's going to be a lot. It's not going to be a lot because yeah. the 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 depression that Storm goes through when she loses her powers, yo, it is fucking deep. Mm-hmm. The conversation that she has with Madeline should have been way deeper than that. Mm-hmm. It should have been like, I'm talking about very fucking depressing. Because in the comic book, uh, literally, <clears throat> you're going to get 
I'm not, not going to spoil it. With Forge, that's it's a whole <laughs> big thing. <clears throat> With Forge, trying to bring her back, it's a whole big thing. So mm -hmm. I don't want to literally. I don't want to tell you what's going to happen with that. <clears throat> it, so, it's sad. It's sad they can't touch on the Loki part of it though. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. They could. Mm -hmm. No, they can't really. Nah. Why not? They can't. It, it I mean, they have they have control of all of it now. They technically probably could. I mean, they could, but it just wouldn't fit right now. Mm -hmm. They have to bring her back because you know. Yep. No, what I'm waiting for is Iceman. Is that, is that actually coming though? That's gonna. You think that's gonna happen? Yeah. Yeah. You're gonna get a. You're gonna get a Iceman. Not, not, get a, not a not a cup blower. <laughs> no cup blowing nah. here, baby. Nah. No, no, cup blowing, not, no cup blowing with this ice man. <laughs> Bobby Driz on another an, another Omega level threat detected. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you're gonna get, and you're gonna get. You thought oh. Scott is a bad. You thought if, if this is going where I the well, he was a jerk. He was a jerk in the in, in the original X Men animated series, right? Like, wasn't he like mm -hmm. kind of a jerk? <laughs> yes. Did I put but you also you're gonna get you're gonna get um uh, Cyclops. He turns into a real dick in this series. I mean, good. Let you him. guys, you guys yeah. are gonna, you guys are gonna, the twist. If they're going the same way that I mentioned a couple shows before this, before the show came out, look up the name that I told you, and look up hmm. that series, and look how much those comic books has gone up. Nice. Hmm. So, go back and watch. This. Go give us some. Go give us a couple of views and comments on that. On that. <laughs> I'm not telling you what episode it was either. So, ah. go look. Go, go look back. Go find it. <laughs> All right. Well. I guess that's um to wrap on X-Men 97. We're very excited about it. Looking forward to episode four. Um any anyone else got anything else before we uh we cut it off? We all we all good over here? Uh, I just wanted to give a shout out again to uh yes. Sean. Sean and the groupie and Rachel. <laughs> I'm still still not seeing Venom. <laughs> but the popcorn bucket yeah. though. Uh am I the only one who this magneto Am I the only one who I'm assuming thinks this Magneto is going to turn any episode now? Hey, hmm. we're, I mean, I'm I'm always I, waiting for it. I don't bro, think so. I don't bro, think so. I already seen him turn him when he showed up. Yeah, so, you think so? I, that, if, if listen, if you know Magneto, then you already understand. Yeah, it's just where, 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 he's where waiting he for his at, time. You know, mentality wise, and just his outlook on everything. So yep. everything is just a means to an end for him. Yep. Yeah, this this you know. And he won't disrespect he can, Charles. He, that's the one thing that he. That's the one. That's the only person that he will not disrespect. Right. Is Charles. Mm -hmm. On the only thing that could. The only thing that will stop him from doing something really fucking sinister. If he did some crazy shit in the comic books, that's the one thing that'll keep him in check because he promised Charles some Charles something. I think I, I feel like it's when he finds out that he's alive or something like that that he'll be like, "Oh, you alive? Why would you say that?" I was gonna say now you just went ahead and spoiled it. I didn't spoil first of all, I didn't spoil anything. Uh, I did I said if I said no, if I, honestly I've I've heard that on like several other channels that there's I, fir first of all I said I if second of no, all I know, I know. that's that's my going theory is that this man is still alive somewhere. Yeah. He is. Yeah, right. he got he got taken somewhere to heal right. or some shit. I don't know, right. whatever right. it is. Right. He obviously was not assassinated. Come on now. Whatever it is. Come on. All right, but that's it's a that, lot. <laughs> that's, that, all right, we're going to cut it right there. It's an episode. But um, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for stopping by. We appreciate you guys all hanging out. Uh, from myself, A.A. Ron, Wendeezy, Big Chase, and Leo, we are the Man Cave 101 Podcast. Uh, hotheads, we see you. Like, comment, and subscribe. You to Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, Twitch, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Kick Rumble. Live every Thursday, giving you all your nerdy needs throughout the week. Take care and have an absolutely fantastic night. Could have had both. Both, bro. Bro, redheads. Two redheads, too. Go on. Wait, wait, wait.